mission is to kill Chaos. That's all I know. When are we gonna fight Chaos? All I care about is seeing Chaos dead. Looks like Chaos has been waiting for us. Chaos. We're here to kill Chaos. What about Chaos? That Chaos doesn't exist? The Chaos Shrine. Just one. Is it true you made a deal with Chaos? Chaos exists. I knew it. I told you. And where there's a crystal, there's Chaos. Come on. Are you Chaos? You told us he made a deal with Chaos. And where? Where did this desperate Stop! urge to eradicate Chaos come from? Chaos takes hold. Me? Chaos? Chaos. This world needs chaos! Hello, hello, and happy Mario Day, one and all. I'm putting my ears in. Please stand by. Imminent chaos. Yes, there we go. Now we just gotta make the the dupe music drop. What can I say except you're welcome? And there's Naz. Right on time. Colonel Sanders says, I missed the sock clip by three seconds. I wish I were faster. <laughs> oh, let's go here. Yes. Happy Sunday, one and all. I hope you all are having a magical beginning of the week. I am. I mean, seriously, look at all this action. All right, we've got yay, we've got Mario socks on, it's Mario day, it's literally a video game celebration day. For those of you who didn't know, that's what we do on Mario day. We celebrate video games. Happy belated Heroes of Might and Magic 3 anniversary. The game turned 25 in February. <laughs> You're a bit late, Naz. That's a great one though. That is a great one. Ed says, and we yell at Kevin. Yes! Oh, it's going to be so glorious. We've got a great stream coming at you today. We're going to be looking at Who Knows Joe's Colony. That's going to be good times. We're going to be making all the space trips. So hopefully that's a thing too. Uh, background music good? I'm still trying with the background music. I want it to be there like an elevator of music. You know, right now it's kind of loud. At least in my ears. A smidge lower. We'll try it like that. Oh, that's probably better. That's probably better. Pugging in with an early pendiculate. Thank you. Welcome, streamer. Welcome. We had a little bit of um, countdown love. Dark Vorbug celebrating 100 bits with the sock biddies. Let's do it once. Let's get it over with. Okay, let's get it over with. You see? See the Mario socks? <laughs> Ed said, Echo, I played Railroad Tycoon 2 until 1 a.m. last night. It was great. I don't know. I was I came out of Friday's stream feeling in some sort of funk. I was like, man, no one liked that game. Rakeen in with the tier one for two months. Welcome back, Rakeen. Thank you. Rykar also at the two months. Rhodes Diet. Nope. Road Diet Rules in with the Prime about an hour ago. We are now at 4,982 followers. We are 18 followers away from the majestic and magical 12-hour celebration stream. Speaking of which, congratulations and well done to the streamer in the chat. Funkin Pie celebrating one year as a Twitch affiliate. I have a bet that they will not spend the next year as a as an affiliate. Beer Killer says, wow, I like those tootsies more than the ears. I mean, I've, I've got nice looking feet. I gotta be honest, right? I'm, I'm not, 
I'm not saying that to the point of arrogance. It's just facts, right? I have, I have cute feet, you know, as cute as like a size 11 foot can be, but it's, you know, cute. No, we are now officially in daylight savings time. I'm not sure how I feel about daylight savings. I know there's been a lot of arguments against it lately. And I think that's just because people want to um, BMC these days. But I think the original purpose of it was to increase economic activity. But I don't know if that's 100% necessary these days. Because, uh, you know, everybody does a lot of shopping anyways, whether it be online. I don't think you're actually adding to the economic development of the country by shifting the, the lights around. BMC, use your imagination, we are. I'll say the M and C stand for moan and complain. Everyone enjoying the lost hour, says Mr. Rusty. Oh. Alex says, why do you need to change the clock to increase activity? You can go shopping one hour later than usual instead of moving the clocks. Um, because it was done in a time where you couldn't, right? It was done during a time where when it was dark out, people didn't go out. <laughs> Crypto Raider says, British moaning and complaining. Yes. Yes, that's what we meant. Funkin says, wasn't it done for farmers? Possibly. I would still say that's economic reasons, though. I don't know. I'd have to do more research into the farmers thing because those farmers are up long before it's light out anyways. <laughs> Brian says, if economic activity is a driver, then my Amazon after dark purchases should be a point of interest. <laughs> Oh, I like that. <laughs> Amazon After Dark. Oh, I occasionally Amazon After Dark. It's not often, but normally like the last hour of my day is spent on an iPad, laying down in bed, relaxing, watching my YouTube videos. Not my YouTube videos, uh, but YouTube videos that I like to watch. And occasionally, you know, I'll be like, oh, Rattlebone says, what is Amazon After Dark? It's just the purchases you make when you shouldn't be making them. Amazon After Dark is as dangerous as Twitch After Dark. <laughs> Rakeen says, in 1918, the agency started the first instance, instance of daylight saving time in the U.S. to help conserve fuel and power during World War I. The idea that was shifting time to get more daylight hours reduced the need for lighting. That makes sense. <laughs> Rattlebone says, oh, so you mean my M.O. Got it. <laughs> yes. Oh. How many days have you woken up the next day and did the whole cancel order, cancel order, cancel order? By the way, we decided yesterday you need to bring back Fall Guys back for a stream. Fall Guys um, is great for like those Friday after dark streams. But I don't think people would get into it as much like during the day. I do plan on playing it a little bit on the 12 hour stream. So another government policy that never ends. Yep. <laughs> it's like once a 10, it's like, oh, well, now we're screwed. Can't undo that one. Lucky Wolf, welcome back. Remy May says, losing an hour of sleep requires one to have slept. Also, hi, Lucky. <laughs> oh.
Ed says they love the random Fall Guy people who show up and dominate. <laughs> who are some of the... Who, they won like seven or eight matches. There was a couple of them. They were just like... Fall Guy fixers. Rob Roy says a significant increase in heart attacks on Monday after the time change. Wow. Just take that I could look see that. This. Like you're messing with the old guys' routines. Is Quayos dressed in a Mario outfit today? No. See, I need to remember this because this one, this volume setting, but Spotify won't let you just highlight over it. So I got to guess that the volume is at like, I don't know, 55%. Since one of my biggest complaints with Spotify, every program, just about every program that has anything to do with audio has the ability to hook in to whatever output or input that you want. Not Spotify. It used to, there used to be a workaround that you could sort of do. But since I built the new computer, I had to download the newest version of Spotify, which does not. So it just goes through my normal system output. So I can't just set it and forget it, which drives me batty. Dark Vorbug in with the resub, a tier three resub, four months. Thank you, Dark. I appreciate you. Yeah, there's no there's no audio options to be able to set your output. What is Remy May watching? Still have 18 episodes to watch after watching like 10 to 15 last night. And I saw that this morning. Mac Jones getting traded to Jville <laughs> for a sixth rounder. Oh, that investment didn't work out. Nadev in with a drink. I missed it earlier. Cheers to you, Nadev. Poor kid, I agree. Because I don't care who you put behind that line. They're not... He has no time. Yeah, I tell you what, who feels sheepish about it, though. Um, for those of you who didn't know, I was born in Massachusetts and live there for the for the beginnings of my life till where I was like 12 and I watched my first football game was when the Bears absolutely wrecked wrecked the Patriots in the 85 Super Bowl and uh that was the first game that I remember watching and so I've been a Patriots fan ever since and so when the when Mac Jones was a consistent starter I was like you know what I'm gonna go buy me a Mac Jones jersey. Hey, Jonesy, I got your back. Eh, that didn't work out very well for me. Maybe the next great quarterback for the Patriots' last name will also be Jones and have the same number. <laughs> oh. Doff says an early echo. It's not early here, Doff. We're doing that silly daylight savings time thing where everybody goes, what are those cheeky Americans doing now? What are we, what are we even doing? Just, just let them be. Just let them be. Let them do their own thing. Kutai says, explain for us foreigners. I bought a jersey and the person who I bought 
the person on the jersey is no longer going to be with the team. And their career looks like it's just fading into the, you know, into the sunset. So it's kind of one of those things like, you know, you don't want to buy a jersey that of a player that's no longer with the team, right? Otaku, welcome back. Sounds like an Amazon after dark purchase. <laughs> it was probably a Sunday after football purchase for sure. <laughs> well, like, oh, well, let's uh, Yeah, I'm going to definitely buy this one. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, I still have my Brady jersey. I'm not a Jersey guy. Like we all have that Fred. Well, maybe not in this circle, but we all, there's a lot of folks who buy like a lot of jerseys. I don't have a lot of jerseys. I have one home and one away from my college team. And then I have, um, that is the University of South Carolina Gamecocks, by the way. Um, then I have a Gronk salute to service Jersey, a Brady home Jersey, and I needed an away Jersey. So I figured, Hey, I'll buy Mac Jones away. You know, it, it was good. What I wanted was a Teddy Bruschi jersey. Teddy Bruschi was an amazing, amazing player. Oh, Richard Seymour. Oh. Using the output from an aluminum volcano to tame said volcano. I'm not sure what you mean by that, Doff. <laughs> Ed says, Brewski. <laughs> Nico says, hey, Echo, I just watched the replay of Friday's Live and just realized I scared you by going AFK for a while. So sorry. You're my first ever sub on Twitch and everywhere else because you de deserve it. Thank you so much, Nico. I I get mortified. I wouldn't say mortified, but I get very worried if I end up missing a sub call out. It's like I have one job. Nadev says, is having a bunch of aluminum volcanoes good? Yes. Aluminum is the bestest. Rob Roy says, the only thing I remember when Echoes College is that their colors are not orange. This is the defining thing for me. <laughs> Chat, out in the wild, it's a smoldering sausage. Everybody say hi, Aiden. How's the smoldering sausage doing? Aiden the duplicant. Welcome back. Lucky Wolf says, Echo is my connection to an amazing community. That's pretty cool, Lucky Wolf. We have built an awesome, awesome community. Rem says, watched his YouTube videos, came to his Twitch, met Who Knows Yo, and then branched out from there. <laughs> so what you're saying is that was a gateway drug, Rem. Naz says, okay, got to get back to the slopes. Have fun, y'all. Naz, thank you for stopping by. I hope you're crushing that bunny slope. <laughs> Balzino says hello. Pumpkin says, and I introduced Kebby and Echo, I think. Yeah, I think you did too, if I remember correctly. Speaking of Kevin, we're going to get ready to do the roll call here. Uh, and then we're going to be checking out Kevin's, Kevin's colony. We're going to do that for probably 30, 45 minutes, do some tinkering with it. And then we'll um and then we'll move on to our standard standard colony.
Lucky Wolf says it's a treat. <laughs> oh. I was trying to give Kevin a few minutes to be able to show up. Damn it, Kevin! Valkyrie just says, I just noticed the next month is a one year anniversary of subbing to your channel. I can't believe a year almost has already passed. I've been watching you on YouTube for much longer though. Thank you, Valkyrie. Yeah, I thought Kevin was feeling better. He streamed on um, Friday, right? Yeah, I think he streamed on Friday. No, he streamed on Thursday. And then he said he was going to play a little bit more. Yeah, I think he missed Friday. That's right. He did stream on Saturday a bit. Thank you, Queen. Jarifa, I appreciate the lurk. For those of you new to the channel, we're getting ready to do the roll call. The roll call is a way we say thank you to everybody for spending their most valuable resource, and that is their time. So, um, all you needed to do to be included in the roll call is say something in chat. It could be an emote, it could be a word, it could be anything. A lot of people like to use the name of their last game they've played. Ed with the Railroad Tycoon 2. Very nice. Elden Ring. <laughs> wild Mender. What is what is this Wild Mender? Wild Mender. Ooh, very positive. Oh, did that happy little frog just jump in that lady's lap? Very cool. Still MATLAB. Oh, Slicky Jab. Oh, I'm so sorry. Dark Vorbug says, I am not here. Also, Deep Rock Galactic Survivor with the 1000 bits. Thank you, Dark. You do a lot for the channel. I appreciate it. Lethal Company with Lucky and some friends. You can hug the frog, says the queen. Helldivers. That one, the more it gets more and more popular, I'm like, I'm starting to get FOMO. <laughs> Am I missing out on something? Should I be playing? But it, it, it's got a very duelist, or not duelist. Um, oh, what was the name of that game? Oh, in space, flying around. And then you land on a planetoid and kill everything. I think it begins with a D. Somebody help me. Help me. It was a shooter. Rytheon with a first time chatter says Deep Rock Galactic. No, it's older than that. No Man's Sky. No... Oh my gosh, I raided this. I used to do raids with my friends for a year playing that game. But you, you're basically collecting loot. Destiny. There it is. There it is. Oh. Whew. It seems like it's got a very Destiny and... Um, um, Helldiver's got a very similar sort of PvE thing going on. Slicky Jeb says, MATLAB isn't that bad when it's doing all the hard work for you. It is surprisingly quite fun. Once you get really used to it, but some of the syntax is a pain in the tuchus. Swarzez Zykin in with the two months at the tier three. Thank you, Swarzez. Shroomzy 
in with the follow follower number 4983 thank you glenn i appreciate it remy may says hell divers nothing like destiny have you ever watched starship troopers it's more like that Shroomzy says, man, I was just watching your video on taming a hydrogen vent. So glad I finally caught a stream. Me too. Welcome. We're glad you were here. Dark giving out the, another gifted sub. This one went to Shroomzy. All right. Here we go with the roll call. Happy Sunday. Happy Mario Day. One and all. Welcome to your Sunday edition of Chaos 2. Abductor, the smoldering sausage, Aiden the Duplicant is here. Alex, Amelia OCE, Amelia, Amelia, Amelia Oche, Amelia, hello, anti social Leon, Beer Killer, Bergetta, Brian Matt 42, hello, Brian. Ed is here, first of their name, Bushman Glenn, Chevelle 57. Dark Vor Bug, Dark Wizard, David Perm, Dex 3D. I think Bunder Pressure just slipped in there. Hello, Bunder Pressure. Doff 87, both Dex and Doff obviously carrying the mantle for the Council of Meeps. Double Dork 596, Drady 81, Doctor Dangerous, Dwarf Gecko, Geeky Gamer. Golden Creations Hawaii. Ha <laughs> ha! Carrots! Jarifa 2. Guerano! Kinda Noobish 85. Kutai Ed! Second of their name. Lucky Wolf 908. Luscious Lucian. Leo Far! The OG. Lie Lie 2425. <laughs> it kinda rhymes kind of rhymes milking milky mr jibo myla loki ditter oh no hi myla mr rusty 8684 mrs music lady 1219 nadev night pie nim otaku 74 priest zero puzzlina queen colero bows and curtsies remy may write the on Riku Ayame, Rob Roy 865, Rykov, Swarzez Zyken, Shroomzy, Slicky Jeb, Snipes 290, Stream Elements, The Bot, TKP Nico, Unvalued Tester, Valkyrie, Weazar, Wikipedias, and Zimmy 99. Welcome, everybody. The summer daylight threw me all off. I, I'll bet you in about 30 more minutes, we're gonna get an influx. Did he skip me? I did not skip you. You weren't on my list. You went AFK too long. And of course, the molten core of pink and evil, Funkin' oh, Pie is here. <laughs> Valkyrie, I did not skip you. Oh. I did skip your, your sub, Valkyrie. Hi, Valkyrie. Thank you for the 11 a month. Oh, you know why? I, you probably subbed when I read that long message and then I just, I didn't even, look, I have no excuses. You can shame me. Shame, shame, worst streamer ever. If I missed anybody else, please let me know. <laughs> oh, there was a first time chatter a minute ago. Unvalued Tester says, finally caught a live stream. Woohoo. Woohoo back. We're glad you're here. Myla says, I mean, you missed my cat. What, what cat? Oh, you had a cat? 
<laughs> Valkyrie says, it's okay, Echo. It's not like my heart broke or anything. <laughs> Much love, Valkyrie. We ready to get started? Bushman Glenn said, I decided to play the Urquan Masters for the first time in a minute. I don't think I've ever... Is that the old space game? Thalric with the four months tier three sub. Thank you, Zalric. Ellie says, hi, chat and echo. It's been a minute. Just popping in to say hi. We're trying to hurry back from out of town to sign off on the final paperwork for our condo. See you all in Vodland. Ellie, congratulations. Big congratulations for you. That's amazing. Ed says, Echo, I still need more redeems. I'm up to 24,000 Echoes. <laughs> it's all right. You'll bet everything unclosed or something and it'll go wrong. Kutai says, maybe Kevin forgot about daylight savings. Seems like a Kevin thing to do, doesn't it? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Hope they're doing well. All right. Let's get in. The first thing we're going to do is go check out Kevin's colony. I was trying to delay it for a little bit, um, but, you know, we'll be okay. Alex with the influx of chickens. Cassian Maribor. Let's see if the follow count updates. Thunder Alexa, bolt with a follow. Welcome, welcome. We're glad you could come by. I, I've been starting to think about saying welcome home, but I don't know if that sounds a little too campy. Like it's a little too cheesy or on the nose, like... You know, thank you for the follow. Welcome home. It just seems like a... And I don't know. It, I heard somebody else say it, and I was like, I kind of like that. But I got I to gotta figure something out. We're now at 4,985. We have 15 followers remaining. My goodness. All right, game. Let's go. Look at this. Look at this, chat. Come on, update. Cycle 5,059. What do we call our collective? Hello, Sulphur. Happy Mario Day. I don't know. This is one of the problems that we've had. We don't know how to actually, you know, refer to the community because I didn't do a good enough job thinking of my, my name. Dark! You're yesing too hard today, Dark! You're yesing too hard! <laughs> Thank you, Dark, so much. For the 15 gifted subs. I appreciate you. Zoldan, welcome back, says, The Echo Echoes, the collective of chaos. The chaos crew. <laughs> Welcome to the ridge. I don't know. It just, it's so hard. It's, it's almost as hard as picking out a name to begin with. I should have just done a better job picking out the name. That way I could have something amazing and adorable like the Huggle Bunch. A little space huggle. All right, so this uncomfortable abode. Now, I'm, I'm going to warn you. If you're an experienced player, shield your eyes. Shield your eyes. This isn't pretty, okay? What's stopping you from using the Huggle Bunch? The Huggle Bunch is the name of a different community um, for a streamer called Space Huggle. Kutai says, no, I want Kevy to be here. I know, I did too. But we can't stop the train now. We can't stop it. We're already, we're already on the tracks. Uh, 
Zoldan says, Chloe's been ill the last few days, so give her some well wishes. I hate to hear that. That's another glowing personality. Slicky Jeb says, Echo, do you want to expound on the story of you obliterating my family? Okay, Slicky. Slicky. Okay, it was one Slickster, and it died all by itself. I didn't do that. Since then, Slicky, Slicky's been blaming me for the death of an entire species. Kokata 357 in with the 100 bits. Thank you so much. All right. Maybe we should... I don't know what to do. I guess we'll just start it. Kevin will have to watch the, the VOD. <laughs> so the first thing... Um, and this is gonna. This is a good learning opportunity for all of you. For those you didn't know, who knows Joe is a um, a streamer. He's a part of our greater extended community, and um, played auction not included all week last week, and did 123 cycles <laughs> in five days. I would not be able to play auction not included. 14.14 hours. And made it 123 cycles. That is less than 10 cycles an hour. I would be clawing up my own eyes. But Kevin did it. But it's important, with that being tongue-in-cheek point um, done with, it's important that as a newer player, you start off that slow. He gets distracted by chat a lot. <laughs> so the first thing I can tell you, there are a few initial problems with this, right? And most of us can already see it. We are relying way, way too much on Mealwood. We have 21 duplicates. For a newer player, that's way too many duplicates. Doff says 53 hours. For cycle 296? No way. Tebow said, play it on slowest speed or left paused a lot. Probably paused a lot. He was also playing on the slowest speed. I tried, I normally stop into Kevin's streams, but when I did, I didn't stay this week because I wanted, um, I wanted it to be, you know, a surprise for me. I have no idea what is going on with this. Oh, no. All right. Who told Kevin that the quickest point... Be the, 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 the shortest line between two points is how we do our pipes? What in the... My goodness. These pipes might as well say made by Kevin on them. What in, oh, what is this? No! Ugh! Oh my goodness. Well, let's just do this. I don't even know what this is for, but it's going away now. That's for sure. There we go, that's a little better. Oh, the horror. There we go. <laughs> oh, I should probably leave him. I should probably leave them. I don't like it. I don't like it, but it is, it's a work of art in its own respect. Uh... Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Might want to check O2. Oh, that's great. Oh, that's wonderful. Algae? Oh, we're out of algae. Okay. Here we go. What in the world? Why did we do this? 
Oh, it's like a little platform. Are we using the cool steam vent hot water to come all the way down here and melt this biome? That's what it kind of looks like. You know, it's the, uh... It's the open air st steam? Steam vent tamer? It works. It's fine. It's fine. I do like this. I've always liked the idea of, like, canals. I need to find some closer algae. Oh my goodness, there's some right here. Okay. Get some algae and... Where are the... Okay, there's one oxygen diffuser here. One here. There's three. There's four. Okay. Which still is only enough for 20 duplicates. Just take a look at this. Did he get rid of all the algae terrariums? It looks like it. You don't want to use algae terrariums. They use too much. Unless you're doing something a little cheeky. Yeah, but so, so this is a typical, I don't say typical, but a common mistake people make is they rely on this sort of stuff without moving on. I mean, we're down to 35 tons of dirt. Now, granted, this is a Terra asteroid, so it's going to have a ton of dirt, a lot of dirt. The storage bins. There's no reason to do this either. Unless you need to bring materials, all we're doing is crushing labor. That's all you're doing here. By spending all the amount of time here... That's all it does, is... Forces duplicates to fill those bomb colony- or those uh, storage bins. New colony, says Metalwork? No, this is a friend's colony. And we're taking a look for it. Taking a look on it. Cloud cover first time chatter says, is this Kebby's safe file? Yes, it is. Of course, we have water sitting here. Why is there a sink down here? What? Why? Uh... Oh, no. How much do you want to bet this is pee water? How much do you want to bet this is cleaned pee water? Dark! In with a gifted sub. This one went to cloud cover. Thank you, Dark. Oh. <laughs> knock, knock. What? Oh, we're over here. Why are we knocking on this? No, we're not recruiting the hermit right now. And why are we building our ladders like scaffolding? It's not scaffold. It's a ladder. Dupes can pass through the upper doors of rooms. Please, Echo, make it stop. <laughs> oh, why are the... There's no barracks. All right, for the new new players, remember there's the room overlay. The room overlay will tell you what you need to do and the benefits that you'll get. So, the first thing we would do is actually put these little fellas in a room. That way they can get the morale bonus. Even though they're doing okay on morale. Ah, uh, we got some that are not. Hence the reason stress is going up there. Oh, look! Echo Rich Gaming is in here. So is Blue Hair Person. That must be a pay. Mm -hmm. Yep, there's the pay. Oh, this is... Oh, there's the queen. Too many duplicates. It's way too many duplicates. This early in the game without being sustainable. Mr. Rusty says the mantra was seems like a future echo problem. I mean, doesn't it? Yeah, this is not happening. We're not using massage tables, that's for sure. Um, Here we go. 
What is this? Six, 13. That's 21. Why is there water sitting here? Whee! Nope. Goodbye. Yeah, but we, we have to do this. That way the duplicates get the morale bonus for sleeping in a barracks. Jimmy says, so today is rebuke Kevin for his choices day. No, we're not rebuking. Cloud cover in with the follow. Thank you so much. 4,986. Bear Killer says, I've been playing RimWorld, and after seeing this, I want to play on again just so I can get this horrible image out of my brain. It does look like we've got a couple of mess halls, although it would be better if they were great halls. Um, for instance, these, you don't need this door, um, door and stuff here. They can actually be in here with the refrigerator. It's fine. And then we'd have enough room to put a... Uh, a recreation building and make this a great hall. Little hangy pot. Little hangy pot action right here. You can filter it if need be. Filter what? Double Dork says, I feel like Echo's a dad criticizing an art project. I'm not criticizing. I'm only trying to show um, some of the, the quick improvements that we could do to make the colony survive and thrive. You know? That's it. We gotta pendiculate in with Nadev. Woo! Thank you, Nadev. Oh. Zimmy was answering a question. Yeah, this is not good. All the pee water is being emptied into the main tank. And why are there so many water sieves? Now we're getting cold damage too. That's an odd... I've never seen a water sieve going into three more water sieves. Yeah, I think this water's too... No, that water's not too cold. This not water's not too cold. Does heating up water kill germs? Yes, it can, but then you're... And you got hot water everywhere. TJ Flames, first time chatter, welcome. All right, so we need to get these in. That way the dupes have some place to sleep. It makes me scared to find out what the duplicates are doing. Because... We have no duplicate labor, despite everything. We have 21 duplicates and no labor. We're down to zero algae again. We do have some water. We're gonna have to put an electrolyzer in. Uh, 20 duplicates? It would have to be a major spawn. <laughs> Because you hired too many dupes! Hired way too many dupes. Do you have any suggestion for heating up 60 t 61 tiles of water each with 830 kilos? Yes. Uh, liquid tepidizer. We'll do it in a f very quickly. <laughs> Slicky says I allow you to get rid of Kevin's slicksters. They don't deserve to live in this monstrosity. Um, yeah, so looking at it, it be in all seriousness, some of the mistakes that we can take from this. Um, it's too many duplicates. Way too many duplicates for the amount of time that has passed and the amount of resources that Kevin was able to get. Okay. Did not utilize the rooms to the maximum effectiveness. So we were suffering from some morale issues. Relying on mealwood of all things for way too long. You can't feed 21 duplicates with mealwood. 
you'll end up eating yourself out. In fact, let's do the math. Let's do the math. It is now time for stream math. Kevin did the room thing on purpose. Why? Nadev, no, the uh, liquid tepidizer cannot boil water. It only goes to a maximum of um, 85 degrees, or it's what its target temp is. What can I say except you're welcome? <laughs> Cloud cover. Askan! Welcome, Askan. Schedule check? I'll do that. All right. Uh, schedule. Oh! Oh! Danger, Robinson. Danger. Oh! Oh! No! No, Kevin! Oh! Oh, my goodness. What? in the world chat I should have known when they're all trying to eat at the same time my goodness my goodness Chances are Kevin did this just to, you know, did it on purpose. I think step one on this is going to be opening up some of these polluted oxygen things. We Unfortunately, we need the air, right? Woo! Now we're cooking with grease. Uh, look at them all sleeping at the same time. What a dumpster fire. <laughs> Ma Z96 in with the follow. Welcome. How many beds in the colony to sleep on, Echo? They're working on it. All right, now we got some nice polluted oxygen in here. Can they get down there? Okay, that's fine. Popped eardrums. Oh, yes. Great. There was six key. Oh, there was probably a lot more than that. Because there's five kilos now. Suffocating. Well, don't go down there. What are you trying to do down there? Gold volcano. Minor volcano. Oh, they're picking up polluted ice. Oh, see, this is more of the storage bin shenanigans. We do not have storage bins. Okay, do not use these. We're dumping polluted water down there for some reason. Yeah, now because there's ice everywhere, the ice melts. Mm -mm. Suffocating. Well, that's your fault. There's plenty of oxygen up here. I got. I have to find where this magical ice can. T oh wow! Duplicates have died. Not surprised. Not surprised. Where is the ice container? They're gonna be doing fine now. Look at all that O2 we've got coming in. <laughs> What? What is this? I I don't even don't even want to know. I do recall him saying he wanted to cause a situation where it was impossible for me to save them. Oh, this is not impossible. This is not impossible at all. Twenty-three kilos worth of polluted oxygen in this tile. Is this the new challenge map? I know, right? Alrighty, everybody's got a place to sleep now. 
they've got oxygen for a little while, believe it or not, because of all the polluted, uh, the carbon dioxide sitting in, that's going to stop it from off-gassing. I do like some, here's some of the things I like. This is creative. Having this little canal thing so the hot water drips down and then ends up into this biome. I like that. That's a smooth move. Cloud Cover says, I've played RimWorld and liked it. Should I get this game? Um, it's hard for me to answer that question because of, you know, I don't know your particular play style in games. But if you liked RimWorld, chances are you're going to like this. It has overwhelmingly positive reviews. Let's get in here. I mean, this is just, yeah. This is, this is Kevin. Have you ever seen the movie, This is 40? Well, this is Kevin. Alex says, Kevin didn't kill any dupes when Echo takes over a dupe died. I didn't kill that dupe. Like, that dupe died on their own based on some decision that Kevin made because I'm trying to find where the polluted ice drop-off is. Oh, here it is, right here. That's what killed the dupe. We saw it on your stream. <laughs> But I think Kevin did a good job. They are self-admittedly not a um, experienced player. But like I said, some of the things we could have done better is utilizing the rooms. That would that would obviously help. Whoop. You should put the tasteful memorial in the water tank. No, that dupe's not getting a tasteful memorial. There was plenty of O2 up here. Yeah. Let's just all wait. Let's all just wait. The dupes are going down with the ship, chat. Memorial or riot? We'll do 20 memorials. How's that? We'll do 20 memorials. Oh, do we even have access? Oh, it's under medicine, isn't it? Yep. And that way, the last dupe doesn't get one. 15? Twelve? There we go. Oh, it's not long now. It is not long now. Oxalite or briar seeds? Briar seed. <laughs> I tried to get him to get a vole in the base. Kutai says, thanks for installing the drag mod. It's much easier to see. It's taken me a little while to get used to it. Um, for those of you wondering what Kutai, I installed the mod, this, See how it changes the color and the text? But it the weird thing is, it also does it for, like, sweeps. And when you're in close, the text stays the same size, so it does make it easier to see. I like that part. But it does, it sort of, um, it takes a second to get used to. Especially after, you know, thousands of hours in the game. I'm very surprised these duplicates are still living. <laughs> oh, they're hanging out in here. Yep. <laughs> Ooh. Pop more compressed PO2. Yeah, there's a big one down here that I would have done. 
There we go. There they come. Here they come. Let the bodies hit the floor. Let the bodies hit the floor. What? Ha <laughs> ha. Who died first? Abe. I do like the little pictures. That's very cute. Is there a way to save that colony? Yes. We, I, I have to go play our colony. So I figured this would be more fun. But absolutely. What I would have done is get them... Oh, look at this. The growth pressure is halted off the mealwood now. Um, I would have gotten off of mealwood as soon as possible. I would have fixed oxygen by digging and expanding. That's another issue here is um, Kevin didn't expand out. So you expand out, you grab all the algae you need until you can get a spawn or oxygen system going. And then once oxygen is taken care of, then you turn your sights to food. But it, it's not, not bad. Oh, we got some issues here. We have some issues here. That's letting oxygen in. Is there a way to link to this map in the Discord? Are you talking about the save file or the seed? The save file? Yeah, I'll drop it in there, Grant Theorem. <laughs> Sluggy says, why are you making Amy's job... Harder when she will get here. She will have a lot of questions from the DWU. All right, where else are they getting oxygen from? Oh, down here. Like at this point, it's difficult to kill more, but at least weeding some of them out would help with the food situation too. I'll be honest, I'd probably do that. Well, depending. Because I don't know how much water is actually on this planetoid. A cool steam vent, saltwater geyser, and some more unknowns. There might be enough water. I do, I did like the canal. The canal's ingenious. I love these sort of solutions. That's probably my favorite part of this, was the canal. Yeah, only some differences I would have made is I would have opened it up a little bit more. In fact, yeah. Seeka Doe says, at least in real world, you can use dead palms to help with the food problem. Just take a look at this. Where are they breathing? I don't understand. I want to find out who the last duplicate remaining is. Oh, we're about to have it because there's no more calories available either. Check the lower chlorine vent's name. Lower chlorine vent. A future echo problem? <laughs> oh. Uh, yeah, like, what are they breathing? I guess there's still some, like, polluted oxygen up here. Regular oxygen, I guess is natural gas. You can't really breathe the natural gas. But they're out of food, so... It's only a matter of time now! The huge manatee. The gassy moo. Did they get a gassy moo? I mean, where is the natural gas? Oh, they must have a flatulent dupe. That's, that sound will forever haunt my dreams. Forever haunt my dreams.
Sulfur says, what sound? That sound. When you're not expecting it, like I'm sitting here recording a video, then you're and just like, oh. Yes. Who's it gonna be? 13 left. Oh, now we're stress vomiting. <laughs> That's the sound of a dupe going on vacation. Yes, it's the train whistle. <laughs> Ooh. It's a good way to end this colony, though. Echo is still alive! Echo is still around! You got it, buddy! Echo, Queen, Max, Ridge, Ren, and Blue Hair Person! Nope, Echo's gone. <laughs> The qu nope, Echo's still around. They're just, they weren't starving for a minute. The queen is no longer with us. Echo Ridge Gaming is still here. That is ridiculous. We finally got the colony down to a reasonable number of dupes though. <laughs> Dr. Dangerous. That's a good idea. You forgot drywall says we are. Okay, you're getting that one for free. That was funny. <laughs> Who do we have left? Six remaining. Echo's still around. It makes sense why. Um, not that it's always going to be that way, but because I believe Echo Ridge and Gaming were the first three duplicates. So it makes sense that they they survived because they have the highest athletics. Three starving, five dupes left. Uh, we need to put priorities on the memorials, though. Where are they getting the oxygen pressure for this mealwood? Echo's still here. Their own vomit. Oh, yeah. That could have been it. Oh, it is another thing. Don't ever use airflow tiles. Look at all the water on that. They've been walking in water this whole time. Don't let oxygen in. You were going to the train station, whether you like it or not. Oh, there's 1,200 calories now. Omelets. We don't need omelets. Where is this pressure coming from? 1,200 colonies of dead dupe. Can't even kill a colony if you try. I know, this is ridiculous. Okay, the calories are gone again. Nope, there's another mealwood. Look at all this mealwood coming up. Oh, I guess the... The vomit. Where's that water coming from? Oh, from in here, from going through there? Well, we'll fix that. And why haven't they picked up the duplicates? Uh, don't do that. Oh, this is all that's left. They have done it. I love the little pictures. It's so adorable. Please disable the pod. There's a ton of pee water bottles in the coal generator room. Oh, uh, yep. That's how they're staying alive. <laughs> eee, 
Yes. Not anymore. With all the mopping, we freed up a lot of airflow. I mean, we got 25,000 calories now. Sink has polluted water. Oh, this one, yep. I need to get the polluted water down here because it can't off gas through the carbon dioxide. Huh? The schedule is fine now. <laughs> I have no idea what the logic behind the airflow tiles. They're all very expensive, too. Echo still made it. But yeah, you could literally take these bottles, put them up here, and they would last a long time. Yeah, even the polluted water here. Forbid food. Oh, I know how to kill them. I'm just not trying to, right? Like, here we go. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> They're dead now. They can't get out. <laughs> oh. Who's it gonna be in the battle royale? Echo's still alive. Makes me wonder how old Max died. Suffocating, but there's polluted water. Oh, it's chlorine. It's not polluted. Echo is down. One more. One more. <laughs> Stream's over. Echo's dead. Who are we rating? <laughs> All right, now we have one left. Step one, let them out. So they can go eat. Rename them to Honojo. There you go, buddy. Save. Save as. New save. Fixed. <laughs> oh. oh, so good. So good. All right, now let me get the save file. I'm going to send that back to Kevin. I'm also going to post the original. It, cause you, it, that colony is very easily saveable. It's a Terran asteroid. You will do fine if you want the challenge. Uh, let me... Downloadables. He ended up sending the entire zip instead of just the... the other. He sent the entire folder with all the PNGs and everything, which is one way to send it, but it also takes up a lot of space, right? Where's my colony saves? Remember when uh, streamer can't even find? All right, I'm gonna say, who knows yo's? Uh, what do we call it? Lucky Wolf said, I wanted to see Echo fix it. I didn't think that's what we we're doing. Dazed and confused. What kind of sadistic Ani stream did I tune into? Welcome, Dazed and Confused. This is a buddy's save file. All right, let's do a poll. You want me to go fix that save? Or play our regular scheduled? Hold on. 
Uh, where is the pole? Pole, pole. New pole. Fix it or quit it? Fix it. Quit it. If you want me to do a disaster safe file repair, I will do it. But I know a lot of people just want to see, you know, our normal stuff. Who knows Joe's disaster challenge? What do we, how do I write this? Doff says, do you have a good place to find the math to determine how the steam turbines? Um, you have to look at the heat, the heat that they can delete versus the heat that is caused. But that, no, I don't have like a quick and easy area. Fixing it for a YouTube video, maybe? That's not a bad idea. I tell you what, if we quit it, I'll fix it as a YouTube. Who knows Yo's last stand? Well, I'm sending that one. And it's going right up here. I'm just going to put who knows Yo's colony. Upload failed. Don't start that with me. Oh, it's because it's in a zip. Come on! Upload a file. Desktop. There it goes. Chat, really? 50 50? <sighs> the poll closes in 38 seconds, chat. Vote and undo the 50 50, okay? Don't do this. Don't do. Do better, chat. Do better. You have a responsibility to the stream. Oh, the poll's already ended. Blast! First time chatter, welcome. It's just closing. Oh, way to go, chat. Way to go. All right, so what I'm going to do is... I have that save file now. Let me go... to here, so I can delete it. Oh, no, 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 I got to send the fixed to... Kevin as well. <laughs> yeah, we'll do it as a YouTube video. I don't know if people are going to like it. And right now, YouTube views are down. But I think it's, it's a good video. Where is... What am I looking for? Documents. Clay. Oxygen always included. Save files. Brilliant. I <laughs> sent it. <laughs> Beautiful. Now I can delete all this. No, delete the colony. What, chat? Busy doing their homework? Shame on you, old chat. What's wrong with Twitch? I'm watching you on 360. Have you tried refreshing? And using the little gear thing? The MATLAB is using up all the resources for Slicky Jam. Lona Czar, first time chatter, welcome.
Forever lost in Oz seven minutes ago. Please tell me Oz is still here. Please tell me I can't do this two streams in a row. Where is it? Absolute. They never go out of here. My clay folder. Look at all the colonies. This is ridiculous. So I just got to go here and I got to delete them all. Here we go. How many auto saves is it saving? March 9? This should be the original, right? Let me check it. Kev challenged like the chaos crew for one video. 21 duplicates, yes. Yep. 21 duplicates. Oh, that's going to be... That's the biggest problem. Do you, perchance, have your very first colony still saved? No. I wouldn't think so. Um, <laughs> I think I hit two... Because you know, back then, I used to always just start a new colony. Just start a new colony. It's what I recommend people doing. It's fun, right? Load game. Miss Prince. There we go. Grant Theram says most saves from pre-DLC days don't work right. Bloop, bloop. While this loads, chat, I think we're going to take a quick break. I am going to go to the potty room. Ugh. I'm trying to get in the habit of taking or reminding myself to take more breaks during the stream. I think they're good to do. Helps keep the, the leg flows. The beginning starts to get repetitive. Oh, I love the beginning. I love it. It's it's my favorites. Okay, I'll be right back. Oh, and I gotta remember to turn up the volume. Pump up the jams for the clips. Hold on. I'm gonna go under the desk. Ha ha ha. Oh, behave. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, baby. Yeah. <laughs> We're back. Do your the trick for you. Whoa! Did I just knock the glasses off my own head? Who does that? That's new. How did I? What was I doing? I don't know. All right, up here. Ready. We need a mod strictly for Zoom purposes. Well, the, um... And Max, please stop fondling the ears. Unless I give you the little wink, okay? <laughs> Not in front of everybody. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Danger, Will Robinson. Danger! You're doing too much, Sulfur. You're guessing too hard, Sulfur Star. Sassy Chick wants to say hi. Hi, everyone. <laughs> that is that is the Sassy Chick. Oh, I can't I can't go under that, can I? Chad, I.
Games is over dramatic much? Me? I'm a sea turtle. Don't you see me? I'm a sea turtle. I. Give me the talking points, Queen. Look, I have been behind the times. I'm behind the times. Queen says ignore it. Jizz cabbage? I've never heard of jizz cabbage. We need the smoldering salami. We need Aiden the duplicate. He's our he's our resident. He is our resident um Wisconsinian? Wis Wisconsinian. Wisconsinite. Samsonite. Wisconsinite. Wisconsin. Nah. The people from Wisconsin. Eh? I'll I'll give you a flute after. Taco said the tacos are spreading wide open. <laughs> All right, here we go. I'm running. Flower blade got knocked off. Um, so did I. It's okay. This is not an elimination one. Ram, Ram, get off me, Ram! Come here, buddy. This is Chester. Hi. If I look, the mouth opens. And it's even got the weird, like, bone, the bone thing with the eye. It's, I don't know what it is, but it looks like maybe it's a baby Jester or something. Isn't it amazing? But we put it right back in Chester's mouth. Oh, who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Chester's a good boy. <laughs> I didn't even get a suffocation warning. There's two of them in there. Oh, chat. Oh, carrots. Yay! Oh. Oh, man. So everybody says that there was a suffocation warning. The problem is I don't hear it, right? All right, let's check. Let's check. Let's see what the let's see what the people say. If the people say we go to an alternate timeline, then we'll do it. If we keep this, we'll keep it. Alternate timeline? Yes? No. You have 1 minute starting now. Kirio 5, welcome. You are not missed. That doesn't sound right. You were missed, but then you came in the chat. Now you were not missed in the roll call. <laughs> Woo! And the man selling the lemonade says, do you have any grapes? And the guy says, no, I don't have any grapes. So he says, okay, I'm leaving. I'll see you again tomorrow. The duck then comes back tomorrow and asked the lemonade stand guy, hey, do you have any grapes? No, I don't have any grapes. I sell lemonade. All I have is lemonade. I don't have any grapes. The duck says, okay, I'll see you tomorrow. This goes on and on and on. And finally, the lemonade stand owner hey! gets very frustrated and says, look, I've already told you I don't have any grapes. All I sell is lemonade. If you come back here, and ask if there's any grapes. I'm gonna tape your bill shut. So the next day, the duck walk. We need to do is clip and then share the clip. Today's stream is not being brought to you by Perrier. And the reason why it's not is because, well, they don't even know I exist. But enjoy your Perrier. Chat, I need your help, all right? I need you to go tie up Sulphur and Dark for their shenanigans. Go tie them both up and put them in the corner and do not bring them any lemonade, any grapes, any brownies, no cookies, no pound bread, no cake. Don't do it, queen. 
Don't bring them any goodies. They'll have to watch the rest of the stream from the corner. <laughs> stream Elements, the bot. Stream Elements, not the bot, a.k.a. our friend in yours, or your friend in mine, Sulfur, with 13 gifted subs. Thank you very much, Sulfur. And Dark in with 13 gifted subs as well. I'm guessing there was a D20 dice roll. Ah. <sighs> Thank you both very, very much. I appreciate you. Ari Marie in with the 17 months. Big yays for Ari Marie. Thank you for the 17. Suarez! Suarez! Mr. Rusty, don't. You're just. Choo, choo. You don't. We don't midstream hype train. <laughs> Mr. Rusty in with the five gifted Subarinos. Thank you, Mr. Rusty. I appreciate you. Swarzen in with the 12 gifted subs. Thank you both very much. I appreciate you. Finally making out of the VOD land to catch a stream. Welcome back, Gary Marie. Yay. Mr. Jibo in with that pendiculate. Yay. Oh, now chat's all getting... What are you doing, chat? What are you doing? Bergetta in with 400 bits. Says, I wanted the train. Well, come on and ride it. Ooh, I too like pie. Where's our music? Did we not? Oh, I was recording. There we go. Oh, there we go. Look, at least you were present here for the train to start. <laughs> Bergetta with 400 bits. Dex in with 100. Thank you both. Rykar in with 500 bits. Thank you, Rykar. I appreciate you. With Love Sparrow in with some pie bitties. Oh, Brian. Brian, go get in the corner too. Can we at least have the fork in the garbage disposal dance? No, we as are. We can't. <laughs> Brian in with 10 gifted subs. Thank you, Brian. Brian must have unchecked a button because it doesn't show how many Brian's gived. That number has got to be up there too. Brian's been around for quite some time. Lemonade stand version goes to the store with the duck and buys some grapes and the duck doesn't even want them. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's great. Brian's at 350. My goodness. Can I come out of the corner? It's too warm here. It's 90 degrees. Yes, Sulphur, you can come out of the corner. <laughs> oh my goodness. Marco says, I was setting up the Twitch Prime sub now that I actually have Amazon Prime, but not, but got gifted a sub before. Oh, well, we'll do it next month. Thank you, Marcos. Did our AC break in the corner? <laughs> uh, Nadev, have a good one. I appreciate you coming by and I appreciate the lurk. How about the fork sound clip? Let's do the fork in the garbage disposal. Let's do the fork in the garbage disposal. Ding 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 ding. There you go, we as are. All right, we need to go pick all this stuff up. Um, we're waiting for our sleep week to come online. But that petroleum still at 119 degrees because if you remember, we were having some petroleum issues. It was not coming out as cold as we'd want to, so it's got a little bit before it gets back up the snuff. Uh, Ed! Oh, Ed. <laughs> Ed? Ed, 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 Ed. Ed, I'll get back to you in a minute, Ed. Just take a look at this. <laughs> Is that a real channel? Dark Vorbug to fix the AC in the corner for the summer. 
with 5,000 bits. My goodness, Dark. It's too much, Dark. It's too much. Dark Vorbug, 5,000 bits. You're welcome. Whoever reads this is a dupe, says Mr. Jeepo. <laughs> oh. Ed gifted a sub to Clemson Esports. For those you didn't know, my alma mater is the University of South Carolina. While, oh, I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what to say. The word Clemson isn't even allowed in the chat. You can't say it. It's a banned word. Yes, the real channel. That's amazing. Oh, Dark Barry, welcome back. Gurren says, hi, chat and echo. Welcome back. Marky, 1988, in with 100 bits. Thank you very much, Marky. I appreciate you. <laughs> People are trying to say Clemson now. Oh, my goodness. It's subbed for two months already. Because Ed's evil. I don't think Echo got the 90 degree corner joke. Oh, I did not. I did not. The corner was 90 degrees. Not 90 degrees in temperature. But rather 90 degree in angle. <laughs> <laughs> Brian Matt says the French variant Clemson. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Uh, mods, can we... I need to add that to the list. How do we add to the ban list? Somebody knows this. How do we add words to the ban list live? So that as we see these words, we can ban them. Kind of noobish with the 50 bits as I almost missed the train. I appreciate you kind of noobish on the mod tab. I don't have a mod tab. <laughs> it's one weird, it's one don't. oddity. Okay. Um, so what else are we going to be doing today? We know we're going to space again. I don't know what... We gotta knock out research, for sure. Uh, applied sciences always takes a while, especially with this... Oh, we have a decent setup. I mean, it's not phenomenal. Am I gonna need radiation for anything else? Should I set up a proper radiation thing? I mean, this isn't bad. Manage moderation settings, moderation block terms and favorites. I don't have a mod tab, Weazar. I have the stream manager tab. It's a little different. Kokata with 1,000 bits. Thank you so much, Kokata. I appreciate you. Question is the next Chaos Crew play along beginning in April, Mr. Jibo. Alex says Clem, son of Clem. <laughs> I want to be able to add all those things. Bushman Glenn is finally on it. Yes. Thank you. Glenn is to the task. Anytime somebody thinks of a way to say Clemson, let's ban that word. How did somebody get the word Clemson in chat? I just saw it, and then I lost it. Ed Hawkin, first time chatter. Thanking Mr. Rusty for the gifted sub. Nicely done. Yes, yeah, Swarzez is able to straight up write Clemson. I thought that was added to the blocked words. Oh, 
add blocked term Clemson. Nope. Add blocked term. Apparently you can't do it. Why are people able to put... It is case sensitive. Yeah, but somebody just put it with a capital C now too. Settings, moderation. I can't do all that right now. There has to be a uh, key command. Hold on, chat. We will get to this, I promise. <laughs> yeah, maybe not. Oh, it's a capital I. Oh, that's pretty good. They are spelling with a capital Y instead of a lowercase L. <laughs> oh, keep up the good fights, mod. Chad has officially taken over the stream. <laughs> oh, man. I need more people in the fight. <laughs> oh, why is it blocked? It's just for funds. Because they uh their school is the mortal enemy of my school. <laughs> is it a football team? Yes. Yes it is. Cocky chick, welcome back. All right, uh, what's our petroleum temperature up to? 108. It's trying its best. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, oh this is an issue. We can go up to what, 325? We need to keep an eye on this. The petroleum's almost to temp. But right now, oh my gosh, the petroleum's 122 degrees because it's still cooling down everything up here. All right, what do I do? What do I do? Um, ice temperature shift plate for the thermal aqua tuner or for the... Oh man, this is gonna make a mess. What if I... Hold on. Okay, I got it. I got it. We're going to have to add a temperature shift plate. Make a new loop? No, this loop will work. It's just got to get everything down the temps first. Let me put this into play. All right, we are back up at our standard times. Let's go down to times three. Because if that thermal aqua tuner breaks, I'm gonna be irritable. All the pros use four water sims, says Kutai. <laughs> oh. Chat, to put it into perspective, when my kids were younger, and they'd get a box of crayons, we would take out the orange crayon and throw it away. That better not be a plastic shift plate. No, it's ice. Okay. Bushman Glenn. I hope Glenn's having fun. Every time somebody thinks of a way to say Clemson. Yeah, we don't even carve pumpkins. 
We paint them. That way you don't see the orange. Got any warts to put in that farm for extra chill? Uh, it's not going to need extra chill. It's just got to get down once. Once it's down, it's going to be good forever. Come on, steam turbine. There we go. Oh, it's getting close. Once the ice melts, it'll put it in a nice little bath. Hopefully it's not too much. Today we're also going to be, I want to, uh, is this correct? I think so. This is the water line. No, this is not correct. It's supposed to go way over here. This is the petroleum line. <laughs> Alex. <sighs> ah, Glenn. Glenn blocked the at Clemson Esports. Oh, that's amazing. Alex says, give me a C, give me an L, give me an E, give me an M. <laughs> oh, that's so good. I like this game. I hope Glenn's enjoying themselves. <laughs> Oh, man. All right, let me get this bridgey here. Uh, did we melt? Oh, now it's too much. It's too buku. Okay, we can mop some. 312? Oh, dear goodness. Somebody come mop. There we go. Hopefully the water doesn't get too hot and turn into steam, because that would be a dumpster fire. Man, what is still so hot? Okay, it's down to 90 degrees. The petroleum is down. It's getting there. <laughs> Bushman Clem. <laughs> 11 block terms to 34. I love it. Valkyrie says, I get that. Our university's major rival has a mascot and it's an eagle and ours is an archer. And my dad said back in the day when they were up against each other in basketball, the cheerleaders ran around the basketball court with fried chicken and steaks. Oh my goodness. That's amazing. And we're too hot again. Uh, the water's getting too hot. I need to do it again. Rob Roy, we're having a good time. We're... We're banning every instance of the word... Um, Clemson and chat's being creative trying to think of different ways to say it. Um, that's actually a good idea. We haven't used the conduction panel in that method yet. So I kind of want to. I think it'd be fun. Echo, if you add warts, the Aqua Tuna will get a break sooner. Um, I see what you mean. I see what you mean. So not to maintain the temperature, but rather just to... To get it cold in here from them to pick up more temps. That's smart. I like that. Who said that?
Wouldn't the buffer tank be better used on the output water instead of the input? Yes. Um, but it, yes, in some instances, no in the long term. The reason why no in the long term is because... All this is going to get down to like zero degrees, right? So for zero degrees, it's going to keep going and keep going and keep going. And eventually the tank is going to get down to zero degrees. So every once in a while, when there is something hot going down, all that hot will go into the zero degree tank. This is only the startup. This is only to get it going. I'm going to add some more ice. It's a little loud, huh? You too. I, I don't like wasting ice this way, but it works. Those poor dupes about to get radiation sickness. Yeah, they are. Petroleum's at 83, but it's coming out of the, the the tank at 96 because it's still reducing the temp of the tank. No wallpaper in space? Not yet. There we go. It is working though, so at least the thermal aqua tuner is doing its business. All right, so this now is can be set up. See, this is the only time that I, when I'm doing like this, I think the text is too big. But the great thing about this um, mod is that you can change the size of that text if you wanted to. I'm not going to because I think it'll help with videos in the long term. I wish we were producing more here. Hundred and forty eight rad bolts a cycle. That's pretty good. Maybe I should lower this down. Oh, it is already on fifty. Okay, yeah, it works. Fuel line is still in the wrong place as code of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Got to switch it over here. I was just getting caught up here with these bridges everywhere. Everywhere! Um, they don't need to be insulated because they are made out of obsidian. Oh, man, the bridges are going to be nuts around this loop. And then one here, one here, one here. What is this? Okay, that one's good, but this one's got to... Ch oh, man. Okay, hold on. There we go, ish. <laughs> more bridges, more bridges. Absolute, welcome back. Happy Sunday to you. Happy Mario Day. This one's got to go. And we need all that sleet weed because we're about to do our long haul space exploration run. Slicky, good luck. Hope you're doing great with your MATLAB. Not for the big... Oh, you're right. You are right. We will take these out for now.
Big Petro Rocket's gonna be somewhere else. And where are we on Big Petro Rockets? Did we get it? We're almost there. Eww, oh, this is fine. Do we? I have mushrooms growing. How are we doing on food? 470? Gristleberry barbecue. Mushrooms wouldn't be a bad idea since we have bristleberries and we have mealwood or meal. meal lice. We could use the juicer. Should we set up a juicer? I mean, we have slime coming in. I thought we put in... I could have sworn we did. Let me find a good close spot. Maybe right here. So it'll go something like this. We don't need a lot, but we might as well. Oh, and I could put it in a room too. Yeah. This is the way. Berry pie? Um. Berry pie's in the oven, isn't it? We're gonna have to remove all this. What's going on here? Body temperature? Why is it at 30? Back down to 20. When are you gonna build the army of Peggy's? Maybe we should do it today. That'd be fun. What's this line? What is this? Oh, it's the natural gas from here. Okay. There we go. Ba 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 ba. This is probably not a great spot for it, but it's fine. Actually, there's a better way to do this, to make sure that carbon dioxide is sitting in here. Like this. Because if, let's say, we lower the carbon dioxide, we'll still want carbon dioxide in here, right? Wikipedia's just made my first Peggy today. Very nice. Slicky Jeb said, just some state space control designs. Are you, um... Uh, computer science? Because it sounds computer science-y. Shroom says, I wish you could color code your lines, like, in Satisfactory. You kind of can, right? Like, we know this is petroleum, but I, I agree. The lines themselves would be cool. What is a Peggy? It's the little bot that comes out of here. But it eats zombie spores, so it's a whole thing. Fun fact, Peggy's can go through restricted doors. <laughs> Peggy don't care! Uh, just a little bit of water, please. Just a touch. Are those unused snazzy suits? No, warm sweaters. Did we inspect everything, by the way? Yes. Ooh, what's in here? Nothing. That's enough. Fungal spores. I have 32 fungal spores. How much you want to bet I have a mushroom farm somewhere here? And I've just forgotten where it is. I need to start pumping this water up. How's our water situation going? Oh, look at our water, chat! Doing great-ish. 
This thing just stinks. What's it running? Polluted water? My goodness. Yeah, it doesn't matter if it's... Because it, st it splits it with this one. There, We have fail-safe devices in. So both lines will stay full now. I need to get a water sieve... Where's our closest water sieve so I can start pumping all this out? I suppose I can just build one, right? I'm starting to get in the habit of just using tiles instead of mess, tile, mess tiles to save on copper ore. It's a bad habit. I've, For some reason, when I was outside of my base, I'd always use mess tiles. I should probably move this up closer to here, too. Since it's a quicker drop-off. You did have a shroom farm, but it got in the way, so it went away temporarily. How are the base temps O2 overlay? Uh, we're a little warm right now down here. Hmm. Electric grids... Electric's going to be doing nice because we're going to put in this major power spine somewhere. Oh, this isn't that colony. Oh. I'm playing. I stopped playing the Chaos Crusade, by the way. The Cycle 5000. Um, spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. Mute for the next 30 seconds. Uh, we'll take the Mallow Seed. I... Always seen this log entry here. Right? These are the last log entries that you'll get for reaching style, um, cycle markers. I was hoping that when you hit cycle 5000, it would give you another log entry. Like, no, seriously. Goodbye. Or something. But nothing. So that's the kind of reason it kind of took the wind out of my sail. The... So that's the reason why I stopped playing it. Which is good because I'm playing too many colonies. I was I was playing too many colonies. Alright, so there's that. We're going to add a storage bin here worth some sands. We'll put some sands right there. That's right. Then we're going to throw a nice auto sweeper. Now I just need a little bit of power. Mm -hmm. Don't you know... What if there is one for 10k? Don't do that to me, Rum. You can't... Don't do that to me. That's just mean. I need to add some polluted water to this. Um, so let me put Enable Auto Bottle on so they'll start picking it up. Now this is going to be right here. That can go away. Bloop! Out. And in. Uh, where are you going in? Where? Oh, that's our water line there. Ugh. Nope, not there either. We'll go in right here. Or maybe 15k? Dodge M says there's definitely one at 20. Iger says I'm on my way to 10k. Very nice. Anyone hungry for spaghetti? That's not spaghetti, and this line is only temporary. Alright? This is more like a, a microwave banquet meal. I cannot believe... No pending deliveries. My butt. There's polluted water right here. Oh, you can't get to it. Uh, why obsidian pipes? No! 
Dang it! Because we're using obsidian pipes at the top side. And I just... Um, a nincompoop. Nin come poop. Nim come pope. Does the new input need a desalinator? I don't think so. It, uh, a little bit. Uh, there is some salt water in there. So maybe. Yeah, but, yeah, I think we're going to do its own desalinator because I don't want, I don't want this water to go down to the space, uh, to our oil biome. I want it to fill these tanks. So we will do our own. I didn't see that salt water. Oi, sorry dog. Fixed. Filter the salt water? I mean, that's... That's not a bad idea. I like that. No, I can't. I'd need multiple filters. Is it only salt or is there some brine in there? Salt. Salt. Okay, it's only salt, so I can filter it. Won't salt water hurt the sieve? No, it passes right through. And vice versa, you can send everything through each other. It only picks up the polluted water. Thank goodness, too, because I have a lot of systems that rely on that. Uh, let's go here. Out. Everything else goes over that way. Not obsidian! Why am I paused? That can go in there. Whoopsie! I just realized all those bridges up there made out of igneous rock. They may not be good enough for the space area. We might have to change those bridges out to obsidian. Wasn't there brine in the right corner? No, don't say that. Liquid phosphorus. Can I mop that? Nope. I'll bet you I can destroy it though. Yeah, no, we're good. Angry! Welcome, I appreciate the lurk. All right, are we set up and ready? Uh, I want salt water to come out. It's going to go into the desalinator. Everything else is going to come through the water sieve. I need this to have sand in it. And this also needs a little bit of power. Let's go check on our thing in here. Okay. Why is it chugging? Well, that's for one reason. Looks like the petroleum's at 50 degrees now. We can get rid of all these. I guess it's only helping. We'll leave it there for a little bit. Pipe blocked. Why is, are you blocked? Uh, what is going on here? Oh, it's because of these. Okay, okay. No big deal. No big deal. It's fine. I can do some of this.
Here's our primary. We bring it all the way. Oh, no, 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 no. Why is this petroleum insulated? That seems like a very big waste of resources. It's traveling through insulated pipes or insulated tiles in the vacuum of space. There we go. Much better. Lady! Welcome back, lady. I don't remember. What's your take on pipe element sensor filter and the bridge filter? Um, I see their usefulness. I do not think it's an exploit. But I don't think they're robust enough for me to want to use. If that makes sense. Is this lead wire? Okay, this is steel. I don't think they're good enough. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. Do you want to build the pipes out of obsidian? Yes. Obsidian will not melt here when these rockets start taking off. Brilliant. The Lord Bucket has returneth. All right, now this is working better. 45 degrees. Yes, very nice. Get rid of this. Oh, I messed up. I messed up, chat. Dang it. Hmm. I didn't do my new trick by putting this on a battery and everything. I can get in there, right? Does anybody have a little bucket of petroleum? What's this? Liquid phosphorus? No. Yeah, let's do a, uh, a pod. That sounds good. I need a little tiny bucket of petroleum. Cornflake, welcome back. The blueprint prediction is up right up here. Is it going to be close? Is it going to be drywall? Or is it going to be something else? There we go. Now I've got a little bucket of petroleum. We're going to move it right here. Yes. We're down to 40 degrees. I'm glad the wheeze warrants don't get the farm station. Dark put 11,000 on clothes. Nice job. Mr. Jibo in with a drink a couple of minutes ago. Cheers to you. Dang it, they took my petroleum. Oh. Sweep only. This is finally fixed. Then when we start using it, the oil is going to come in nice and clean. Look at this gloriousness. Oh, I love it. Jimmy Tea Time got three sets of gloves this week. I hate gloves. <laughs> Tell us how you really feel, buddy. Uh, slime? Zero? What? How is that... Oh, so that was just a bug? Why does it say zero? That's odd. And, ooh, I wonder... Wouldn't this be cool 
Wouldn't this be nice? Da, 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 da. Oh. No, I need more water. Oh, I can still do it. I can just put a one of these in here. Really? A Beach Boy song? Hey, Pyroy. Uh, careful, your age is showing. <laughs> it needs more water. One, two, three, four. Hello, can we get some water, please? Really, that's it? Why is everything taking so long? Dravy says, speaking of age, how old were you when the Beach Boys formed? I don't know when the Beach Boys formed. Where is it getting all these dinky amounts of water? At least we're finally picking up this. I'll put this on a priority of four. And I'm not going to forget this, chat. Please don't let me forget. Ooh, I also can enable auto bottle here, enable auto bottle here. 1961. The Lord Bucket says, isn't that a chocolate ad? I wasn't even a twinkle. All right, why isn't this pumping? Oh, because this has no power. Are we working on too many things again? Perhaps. Are we going to learn our lesson? Perhaps not. Uh, 100 kilos, that's plenty. Get rid of that. Now I can put my conveyor receptacle in here with all the metal ores that we don't have. Put it right here. Peggy, I'm coming for you. Don't worry, boo. Body temperature? Why is it so hot down here? Uh, okay, okay. I like the dancing raisins. I remember the dancing raisins. I used to collect the raisins from McDonald's. That will age me. Boop. How are we doing? 32 degrees. Slow but steady. Alright, now can I get my one? Just one. Got it. Thank you. Move it right here. Why are we planting mushrooms anyways? Because we want to have a nice juice bar. Pufflet eggs. Sure. Remember the McDonald's Transformers? Your french fries would turn into a robot. Your burger into a different robot. I do not remember that one. What are you doing out? This still isn't working. I guess it's not pumping right now because there's not enough natural gas in it. But it is good now. All right, this is gonna have a wart seed in an attempt to cool this area down. This has plenty of power for us. Probably going to need it for the Peggy system. Why is it so vibrantly blue? 
<laughs> it's cobalt wallpaper. You know what happens if I don't use wallpaper. Oh no, he found the slug, says Dark Wizard. Ooh, blueprint prediction. Wow! This might be a new record. What's this? 110, 122, 179? So 180,000 echoes up for grabs. Let's all listen for the happy sound. Everybody close your eyes. Close. You too, Ed. Ed will wait. It's fine. We'll wait. All right, here we go. Uh oh, I missed it. Oh. Oh. Why? Basic orange juice. Hmm. Of all things, too, they had to be orange. Of all things. I think we get two predictions today, though. Delahano of Light in with the Prime. Four months for Delahano. Thank you very much. Appreciate you. Ugh, basic orange shoes. If only my new friend wasn't already banned from the channel. My new friend. <sighs> Naven, first time chatter, says, Hey, Echo, loving your vids. 800 hours, really bad noob here. Naven, we have a saying over here. We have a saying. 800 hours? Don't worry about it. You're still in the tutorial. How do I do this? I gotta mop it here and here. <laughs> Emotional damage. On the Sleetweed Farm, isn't the chill leaking? Yes. Yes, it is. I suppose I could use metal doors, but the chill will still leak through the metal doors. At a minimum, we can close it up here, though. <laughs> Zaldin says, you called me your friend. Ed says, it was a typo. <laughs> oh, so I suppose this will help with a little. I don't know if it'll even help with transfer. Because now the it's just going to go through the metal door, right? Here we go. Please no bead bead thing. Bead pump? Clemson booties for Echo Tooties. They're not Tooties. Okay, Bear Killer? They're Tootsies. Tootsies. You gotta get your cute names. You gotta get your cute names right. Why not use vacuumed double liquid lock? Oh, because that's just a pain. That's excessive. It would work. If I was using the great cheaty doors, like somebody we know. Uh, lead? Yeah, that's fine. Iceland says, actually, it's not tootsies, it's piggies. <laughs> Best doors. <laughs> Oh, I am jealous of the cheaty doors. I, I'll be honest. I could use some cheaty doors in my life. All right, now that we've got all that finished up. 
Ooh, I got some space here. I could use this. 20 out of 20 with cheaty door again. More like crashy doors? Do you have issues with the doors, Nuki? <laughs> I'm not drunk, I swear. No one believes you! Ed says they did say Tootsies. Check your prescription. I do need a new prescription. Um, I'm, I think I'm going to have to start wearing glasses full time. It's not, it's, I don't have much longer. <laughs> oh, pendiculate from Mr. Jibo. Thank you, Jibo. Oh, look at this. We didn't even get the droppings. Sometimes you end up with the petroleum or whatever in here. Um, so that's in there. Power. I love this new system. It just makes sense. And the insulated doors and airlocks mod work together. I know, I just don't like... I don't like adding gameplay mechanics to my mods. I've never liked it. In any game, not just Ani. I like playing it the way devs made it. Which the counter argument, of course, is that, well, they added mod ability. And I like mods, I just like them for UI enhancements. Well, the battery should be inside the steam room, but you do you. No, it would be good to have it inside, but then you'd have to make it a little bit bigger, too. Uh, let's go... Give me some of these radiant pipes. Yeah, that'll work. It's getting down there. We're down to 18 degrees. Abbotton at the tier one for seven months. Thank you, Abbotton. Did we finally? Uh, we're f we're still working on it. We got blast shots for days, but we're still filling them up down here. That way, the whole system's automated. What can I say? You're welcome. The orange piggy was thrown for 80 yards and a touchdown. <laughs> the orange piggy went to the market. The orange piggy. This orange piggy went to the market. This orange piggy stayed home. I mean, that's just... That's wrong. Speaking... Where's... Why is this taking so long? Hmm. I think next time I do this, I'm going to use two. Actually, I got room. Let's expand this. Let's expand it. That way we're getting faster rad bolts. How much power does... Oh, my goodness. Oh, well, that one needs a new one, huh? Uh-huh. <laughs> okay, yep, uh-huh. That can go like this. This can go like this. Uh, right across. Yeah, we'll have it run this whole system here. Now hurry up, because we're losing power! I need more power, Captain! It's hilarious, with 39 duplicates that we're still missing on duplicate labor. Use a storage tile instead of a storage bin. That's a good idea. Um, in fact, I could use it right here.
that storage bin usage in that um, sauna for my video this week has... It's kind of changed my mind about the storage tiles a little bit. No, I don't need it there. I can just deconstruct this. Mr. Rusty said, you seemed like you liked them in the VOD. Um, I did. I really did. I, I don't know what it was. They were bugs for me before or something because I could not get it to use them. But then we had a couple of hot fixes. Well, we had an update and a hot fix, so I'm thinking maybe that helped. No. There we go. I can put one here, here. And probably do something like this. No, I can't do it there. But I can do it here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Do not deconstruct. Could you please cancel the farm tile? I can't. I'm working on it. I'm working. It's gonna be it's gonna be great, sweetheart. It's gonna be great. Gonna need another wart seed. Twenty-three degrees. I don't wanna add liquid locks. Oh, this has gotta say if it's above two hundred. And this has gotta say ninety. Let's say 90-60. I hate when I miss chat, especially like the conversations. You know I don't like using the word hate, but you know what I'm saying. Let's can we go through here, please? Um, I I get FOMO. Uh, that's gonna go have to go like this. Yeah, it'll work. I can point it here. I can have another rad bolt reflector go right there. Hey, Echo, last attempt to point it out. You will still have more liquid phosphorus in your water you're putting in your water tanks. What? Why? Where is all this liquid phosphorus coming from? Where, like, it's everywhere. Go mop! Mop, mop, mop! Uh, is that enough? I'll get a little bit more. I need more so the pitcher pump can get it. Coach Man says, I'd like to say that ever since Echo explained how he sits in the chair, that I've been doing it as well to test it out. I am very surprised how comfortable it is. It is. It, it, I like to keep up my flexibility. You know. Only took like two sound alerts. You did not sound alert that before. I will refund you, though. I would. I always read the sound alert messages, though. You must not have said it in the message. <laughs> what is the EATA on the regolith melter? It's going to be a while, buddy. All right. Is all of it gone now? Yes. Oh, this water is flowing nicely, too. Oh, wow, and look. This thing's actually producing water. Oh, amazing. Ooh, pod. Pod, a pod. I need to start stretching daily. I'm less flexible than both chambers of Congress. 
<laughs> well done. Well done. Decorating farming or decorating? Nope. Goodbye. You are the weakest link. All right, so now I can go like this. Oh, I can't put one here now. I wish these were background buildings. Or I could use the mini sweeper. Okay, no, this is fine. This is fine. I'll just do it this way. And dirt. Dirt. I wonder what the radiation range is. So six tiles away, it's still pushing out radiation. So that means this is still adding to this radiation, so it's worth it. And one more. Either you don't always read the messages out loud, or you don't always read them all, because some of my sound alerts have been missed. Not today, but still. Uh, so you got to realize, right now, it's a little easier to keep up a chat because it's not going too fast. But sometimes it's just going too fast for me to read and play. Because one thing that I constantly think about is, is the stream entertaining right now? You want to see what's not entertaining? This. You see what I mean? When I'm just sitting there reading chat, it becomes less of an entertaining stream. Now, they understand that it's going to happen sometimes. The first sound alert I sent about the liquid phosphorite, you read the message directly under it, but not the alert. Hashtag pro. Grub grubs are very entertaining. Okay. You know, that would be great. If I had a speaker in my ear that could read chat aloud to me. Of course, I'd still have to look and read because you'd lose a lot of context saying it out loud. New prescription telling you. I know. I, I didn't get to finish my story, but I'm sitting there with my phone and half the time I have to do like if I have my glasses off, I'm like it's like, oh I didn't want to be this old. You would remove your monitors within five seconds. Yeah, no kidding, because you're met like all the emotes. That would be a train wreck. Is there cool water going up here? I feel like this cool water could be used as a coolant. This is petroleum. This is salt water. Such junk. Let's do this. All right, this is going... They're both going up. No, this is water going down. Whoop. There we go. Just another reason why having a batch of chilled water is very handy. Now, I know this is going to heat it up for a little bit, but it's not going to last the test of time, right? Once it's done heating it or chilling it, it's going to be fine. Mm. We'll just rejoin 
Oh, you could copy Kevin and have a co-host. I couldn't do that. I don't know how he does it. There are some times when he's sitting there talking and then Liz starts talking and then he's trying to talk over Liz and then Liz just keeps talking. I love it as the viewer, but it would drive me batty. It would drive me, I couldn't do it. Lady in with the lurk. Appreciate you, lady. Uh, da, 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 da. Um, what's weird is, so the reason why my eyes are going bad is because of astigmatism. I have two things in my eye. One's astigmatism and one's something else, but I can't remember what the other thing is. Mr. Jibo with the doubt. Be right back. Need to make some lunch. I mean, that's not a bad idea. I could use a snacky snack. I do like snacky snacks. I just got the orange super fan shorts. I wonder what team they are for. You're evil. <laughs> now my memory is starting to go. Mr. Rusty says, we just yell at Kevin to let Liz talk. Here we go. Body temp? Why isn't this flowing? Okay, it'll get down there now. A lot quicker, I'm assuming. It is carbon dioxide, so it's not going to be... Oh, look at it. We already have one coming. Uh, no power? My butt. My buttocks. That is not possible. Where's the petroleum? Um, hello? Why aren't you pumping? Oh, because I had reset this. Ugh. Colonel Sanders says, you turned it off, boss man. <laughs> no, we specifically allowed Gamecocks. There we go. Power will be restored here momentarily. Let me kick this up to a five kilos. I guess it doesn't make sense to have this in here anymore. Can I get it? Oh, 710 degrees. No, not really. I might be able to do this, though. This is only 115. And then something like that? Yeah. Kilo who first time chatter. Welcome. Bloop. Perfect ish. Sour gas time. Kilo who says long time lurker. Uh, here we go again. Is it heating up too much? No. The counterflow is doing great. In fact, I need to add a couple more radiance back to it. <laughs> OMG, one tile does not have drywall. Let's see, what are we getting up to now? 380? I'd still like it a little higher. The higher you get it, the more efficient your petroleum boiler is. Stiso! How you doing? 
Alright, that'll be better. And power should be returned. Alright, where were we? Oh, look at this! That worked like a charm. Very nice! Alright, so now we have mushrooms. We have bristle berries one day when the temperature returns. It, that's what it kills me about. So many different of people's other solutions. Why don't you do this, Echo? Why don't you do that? Thirty degrees still. Where is it picking up this heat? Twenty-nine. Oh, it's in here, isn't it? Fifteen it is. Fifteen it is. For all the squirreling, I'm starting to wonder why Echo doesn't use alarms. I've used them. When something's really important. Uh-oh, it's a pay. Researching rocketry farming grease monkey with allergies. Uh, with all the crops we have, I don't know if... Especially with the giant bristle blossom thing. Of course, we're already making allergy medicines, aren't we? Curative tablet. Where's my allergy medicines? I mean... Yeah, let's do it. Everybody loves a pay. Get your dupe raffle in! Get your dupe raffle in. Raffle, raffle. This pay can go right down here. Uh, what'd we say pay is doing? Researching and rocketry? Nice little pilot. We'll make this pay a pilot primarily. Yes. And priorities pay. Just take a look at this. I don't want to. I don't want to look. You can't make me. You're not my real dad. Rocketry. You have two unused warm sweaters. I'm sure Duke wants to wear it. <laughs> no. I do not put the warm sweaters on. Everybody wears snazzy suits. That's it. Until we get to the point in the game where we don't have to wear snazzy suits. Then we wear nice things. Uh, apparently we don't have clothing on our sweeps. Oh, I guess I gotta do it this way, right here. All right, that's working. This is working a lot better. We basically doubled the amount of rad bolts to get in here. It'd be great if these were firing off sequence. Oh, wait a minute, I didn't... I gotta get some automation here. That way this rad bolt generator stops firing too. Why are you tracking how many sweaters you have, by the way? Who knows? There is no telling. <laughs> Whole lot of Clemson names. Whole lot of Clemson names. <laughs> Rem is spending big money on tickets right now. Um, is this filling up? There's no way we're using that much, right? Oh, 
we using five kilos per second? Like, I know we have a lot on the colony, but wow. Get me an orange. All right, let's up, let's up it. Let's up it. Let's go 7,500. Been watching your YouTube content for the last few weeks. You've helped me great with Ani. Thanks, man. Versa Kill, first time chatter. Welcome and thank you. Appreciate you stopping by. Just a reminder to everybody out there, if you're not yet following the channel, we only have 13 more, 13 more <laughs> followers until we hit 5,000. And once we do, we do the 12 hour celebration stream with giveaways and lunacy and all sorts of good stuff. Now the water is too hot. Why is this water too hot? Why have you forsaken me? Where's it's picking up its heat? Like in... Right here. No, no rap roll call. EMAP! EMAP in with the seven months. Hello! It's 50 degrees here. Oh, probably because all these transformers. Ugh. I'm about to put a whole base cooling situation or is what I'll do. There we go. Hmm. <laughs> Bro echo. Uh, I do want to work on some Peggy. We are waiting for Sleet Wheat. We're almost done with petroleum rockets. So we are knocking out the last of the research. Excited about it. Um, oh, speaking of which, how are we doing on databanks? We have 89 there. Uh, 413. So it's 500. All right, ready? 250 plus 60 is 310. That's 710. 960. 990. Hold on. 990. 1020. 1050. 1300. 1360 is what we have of need. So we still need a lot. 89 plus. Four thirteen. So let's say ninety plus four twelve is what five five oh two? And we got thirteen sixty. So we need eight hundred and fifty more data banks. You made pipes out of obsidian, says we Azar. Of course I did. Of course I did. Well, at least we know they're going to be good. Ugh. Now I'm out of obsidian. Whee! There we go. That should be better. I didn't announce stream math time. Oh. <laughs> Pumpkin says, my dupe is waving furiously to you. Hello, dupe. Happy Mario Day. All right, here we go. Um, six, 14 degrees in here, 16 degrees. 
This is coming. Oh, yeah. We're, we're just knocking it out. So, all right. I'm going to take another quick break because I need to get a little snacky snack. Um, next time, I'll get my pee and my snack schedule on the same. We'll work on it. I want to set up Peggy. And by the time we should have petroleum engines here soon. But I still got to send the data researcher back to space as well. What are we going to send up? Let's send up the pickled meal. Pickled meal. There we go. And you have enough oxalate and plastic. Okay. Yep, they should work on that here. No. Oh, they already loading it? No, that's only six kilos. Raffle first. People are still throwing down on the raffle, so I didn't want to. I didn't want to stop while they were still blowing their echoes. Every raffle tick bought is better health for the uh, for the economy. Economy. Uh. Okay, now it's saying... Okay, we still have another errand. Somebody's bringing some more. We might need to bring other food. I guess I can bring a little bit of gristleberry. Gristleberry. What dupe are we raffling for? A pay pilot. It's a pay pilot. Right here. Speaking of which, Paycation has a lot of skills. Ding! Zorbu with the follow. 4,988. Winning. Uh, Snip only has one. Oh, they are also a nice pilot. Let's go, Snip. Super duper. That will work. I am Killer Dove. Enjoy your adulting. I appreciate you. Uh, I thought I gave power tech next. There we go. I still haven't updated the power technics hat. Anybody else sitting super low? Low car. Why are you doing that? Oh, we're out. That's fine. Uh... That should be... Oh, no. This Pikachu. Pika! They've been around for a minute, too. All right, there we go. All right, now for real, I'm going to take my break. The music will be in the background. No, it won't. I'm just going to do this. Be right back. Peacemaker 109, first time chatter, welcome. Strange, I just spent like four hours watching your Let's Play, and here you are. <laughs> Every Wednesday and Saturday, my friend. Ah, uh, still milligrams. At least, up oh, there's that more lead. Let's go scoop up that lead. Uh, Carrie? Carrie's about to die. Why is Carrie about to die? Is that oxygen? <laughs> oh! Oh! Echo's dead! Get a whole huge custom deck. Or do you die after three losses or something? Damn you! 
Well, we got our first one, right? Oh, and it still shows our three. All right, somebody tell me when. Somebody tell me when. When, when do we when do we let them out? Oh, they're running out of air. Ugh. Look, I didn't tell you to dress me in orange. You did that. I didn't do that. You dressed me in orange. Mm-hmm. Yep. Ah, oh, suffocating. <laughs> oh. oh, can you not? Crispy says less interesting than even WoW side quests. Burn. What up? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Woo! Wow! I feel bad for that dude though. Feels bad, man. Oh man, he's straight hadley. Old chat. Kutai has renamed themselves. <laughs> Kutai renamed themselves. Chat. Kutai's name is now Kutai Ed. <laughs> oh, that is so great. Hello, Kutai Ed. One second. All right. Milan, not again! Oh, and I'm sitting there on my phone. Ugh. You better run. Nope, run fa Says, hey Echo, date is going great now, just stopping in to say hello. I hope your date takes your phone and flushes it down the toilet. <laughs> you can't stop in when you're on a date. You can't stop in. Tell her I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. Let's put him in a Yes. Let's put him on a pigeon. Look at those ador- it's a onesie! Mm, it's even got the little feeties! Oh man. Pumpkin pie! Queen is here! Go there, buddy. This is Chester. Hi! If I look, the mouth opens. And it's even got the weird, like, bone, the bone thing with the eye. It's, I don't know what it is, but it looks like maybe it's a baby gesture or something. Isn't it amazing? But we put it right back in Chester's mouth. Oh, who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Chester's a good boy. <laughs> and look, it's side-by-side -side buffer tanks. Who doesn't love that? Look, no one tell Komori. It'll still be a three pump max. This up here. Whoa! You don't get to see that too often. That's not supposed to do that. We did not cover it with the requisite amount of things. That is a straight up bug. It's chaos. Yay.
Weazer says, because there's a Vodlander here. Yes. So Weazer and, our, Weazer and I have this battle going because I like to wear the nice comfy socks, especially when it's a little chilly out. And Weazer is like, no, you need to wear the fun sock. No one asked you, Kevin. No one asked you. No one asked Kevin. Oh, a fairy swing. Or it's probably not a fairy swing. It's probably a fairy's wing. <laughs> Got it. Oh. Nemetrek says, fairly sure it's not a mod. Well, here's the storage bin. Oh my goodness. No way. What? Chat. How? What? I have never seen that. I don't even Since know what that when? clip is referencing. That has to be new. I don't even know. Welcome back, chat. I hope... I hope you got up and stretched, grabbed a snack. Naming the storage bins? You can't name the storage bins. Audio 85, there we go, oh, there we go. Now we're back. Doff still buying raffle tickets. <laughs> what up, bro? Please tell me Bro Echo was not in there. <laughs> what up? <laughs> it's so cringe. Oh. Twice? Where's the storage bin? Ah, oh, ick yellow storage bin. They named it ick yellow storage bin now. They changed that. Zolden said one of them was Broeco saying how much he wanted a hot tub streamer. <laughs> a hot tub stream. <laughs> to be a hot tub streamer. Phrasing. Um, which one's the ick? This isn't ick yellow. It's wonderful yellow. Oh, this is Kevin's colony. I really wanted to watch this one. Um, we decided I'm going to do a whole video. We had some fun with it in the beginning of the stream. Welcome back, Amy. All right. I think we've got enough because I need an exclamation roll 74. Please don't give me something in the mid 30s because like I have to count a lot. Mr. Rusty. Thank you, Mr. Rusty for rolling an eight, which means it's going to be somebody who really wanted the pay. So all those other ones got dunked out. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I miscounted. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Underpaid intern from Just Not Overthink. Wonderful. Whoop. All right, let's see what all these other requests are. A drink and a pendiculate from Master Jibo. Thank you, Mr. Jibo, not Master Jibo. I wonder how many times I've said that. Woo! All right, so we're gonna complete this, this. I'm not naming a vent or geyser bro echo. How do we get you to dress up as Joker again? I always do a, um, for Halloween. Chat, 
Cheers to you, Mr. Jeebo. I don't... What vent or geyser? Most of them are pretty named. Here's one. Bro Echo. <laughs> Kevin, welcome back. Why? It's 4.30 p.m. I slept for so long. I hope you're feeling better, Kevin. We, um, I sent you on Discord the colony back after I fixed it up. Um, but I'm also going to do a YouTube video on it as well. Like a disaster save sort of thing. I really liked your your canal. Slinky J says, okay, I'm back with a bowl of cereal, a cookie, and a bucket of popcorn. So I'm ready for everything. Never mind, the cookie's been eaten. Note to self, don't carry cookies in your mouth. It won't end well for them. <sighs> Liz, welcome back. Yeah, I think there's a picture in the Discord somewhere of when Cocky Chick and I did Harley Quinn and the Joker. The makeup turned out really good, but I didn't get to finish the complete outfit on stream, but the Halloween pictures, it's from a couple years ago. All righty. We're not getting another dupe. I like, I want to stretch them out now since we only have eight left from our plans. I want to stretch them out, so... Let me turn that down a little bit. Yeah, that's better. So we can at least do one per stream. Do we have another prediction to do? I might have missed a new follower in all these dupe raffles. Maybe it was Zorbu. Oh, that's right. Unpaid intern. Thank you. Woo! <laughs> oh, unpaid intern. Thank you. Thank you. I'd like to thank my family, especially my mom. Also, I'd like to thank the chat for making this very surprising for me and special. Thanks to Mr. Rusty. Woo! Can we get a shout out in the channel for Who Knows Yo? Um, we did, you'll see it in the VOD if you're just joining us, that we did go look at their colony. We had a little bit of fun with it, but I'm going to do a serious, um, like, disaster save attempt on for the YouTubes. Werewolfade. Werewolfel? Werewolfel. With the follow, thank you. That's 4,989. We only need 11 more for the 12-hour stream. 11 more. It's going to be great. That means it's probably going to be happening sometime in March. Did Echo Ridge and Gaming die? Are they still alive? You'll have to check the save file. I sent it to you. You'll love it. Start to unfollow now, chat, says Swarzas. That's just mean. All right, what are we down here? Down to three degrees in some spots. Ten. It's getting there. Finally. That won't be too long. Oh, we can make our um, our juicer. Where's our great hall? Or maybe we just do a separate room for the juicer? Hmm... Where could it go? I suppose right here. Boop! Boop! Oh my gosh, we're so out of materials. Tissy boy! With the follow in as well. Thank you very much. 4,990. Uh, 
Not airflow. Let's just do regular tiles. Juicer! There we go. I need some water. Where am I going to get this water from? I'm not going to use pee water. I mean, I could use pee water. Yeah, pee juice. Let's do it. I don't think they'll get food poisoning from it. We're going to find out. Can we dress a dupe using the wardrobe, says Oxyderp? The juice room needs special wallpaper. We'll do it. We're going to do some wallpaper. Uh, let's get some other niceties in here. <laughs> we could do a, a water fountain, too. Oh, we could do two juicers. But then I couldn't do any decorations. The, the juicer is actually a four by three. It's ridiculously big. Uh, let's do strawberry speckles. Let's just do random fruits everywhere. Some grapes. Is that all? I only have three. Oh, nope. I have some sour lemons. Then we'll go back to the beginning. Grapes. And some lemons. There we go. Yay! Liz, did you also sleep till 4.30? Whoop. Rem has 12 echoes left after the spending spree. <laughs> Don't shame me, Echo. <laughs> I'm not shaming you. He said it. I know we have some gold. That'll be nice. And then we can use a couple of flower pots. Kevin said we had the day off. Well, you took advantage of it. <laughs> Colonel Sanders. No, it, it'll look better once you put the... the I see what you mean. But once the statue's done, it'll look better, okay? It'll be, it'll be nice. <laughs> oh. By the way, why don't we build base tiles with metal? Uh, you're saying the transfer thermals around? All right, what else is going on? Oh, they wanted to research room. I think the aqua plaid. This will be nice. Ooh, actually, just one strip because it looks like little windows. And then we'll pick something else to go the other ones. Maybe some fresh white. There we go. <laughs> Kevin can't find his shirt. 
<laughs> I, I that makes sense based on your colony that I saw today. Based on your colony, it makes sense that you can't find your shirt. Is that water? All right. That's good. All right, let's get working on the Peggies. Oh, and more research. <laughs> what does that mean? <sighs> oh. I need... Uh, I need a refrigerator in here. That way they'll load it up with all the, the goodies. Food, food, food. Bristle blossoms are starting to grow again. is I want to make sure that we are harvesting our our mealwoods. I'm pretty sure we are. Yes, we are. Oh, look at this. Down to 19 degrees. Like it's all chocked full. Look at this. We finally caught back up. It's glorious. Absolutely glorious. Uh, down here. Meal wood. The shrooms are lacking <laughs> wallpaper. Berry blossoms. Or bristle berry. And then mushrooms. And then I'm going to take pickled meal off. Oh no, that pickled meal is still sitting in that rocket. Ooh, that's awkward. Okay, we've got a decent amount here. We can crew it up. I see plenty of room for wallpaper. I'll bet you do. Metal tiles plus 50% run speed and looks a lot prettier. I mean, that's fair. Shall Shallow Pie, you're crewing this adventure? Okay. I'll trust past Echo. Uh, where's my... Change. Whoop, whoop. And... You've got water. You have enough fuel, even though you're not hooked up. Why hasn't that been fixed? There we go. Beautiful. Oh, did I bring enough plastic? Yeah, that's right. Oh, that's not enough plastic, is it? Dang it! We didn't bring enough plastic. Whoever reads this is a chlorine gasp and <laughs> that's Mr. Chivo. <laughs> we didn't bring enough plastic for sure. Oh, look at us knocking him out of the park. Can't touch this. Da 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 da. Can't touch this. Why didn't you fire? Oh, you're entombed. Now we're definitely missing out on some of this slime. We'll get some of it, but not as much. You aren't MC Hammer. Yes. True statement. <laughs> All right, Peggy. How am I going to get this to work? Right now, up to 18 tons of steel. That's not great. Mm. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. 
Dupes fixed some of the obsidian pipes. I think the rocket boiled them. Check the temps. No, they, we had a pipe up there that needed... Um, that needed to be fixed. I just put the ladder there to do it. Oh, we can finally put here um, the new rockets in, though. Petroleum engine. Space blocked. Don't start that because I already have the pipes in. There it goes. Maybe I still have the other one selected. Brilliant. All right, now Peggy. Let's sit down at this research station and figure out how we're going to deal with Peggy. We want lots of Peggies. Finished interplanetary launching. Very nice. All right, what it needs is zombie spores. We don't have... So we could seal the whole thing in. We don't actually have to get in there. Because once you have the zombie spores going, they're going. So all I really need to do is something like this. Not copper. Boop. I'm going to get rid of this door. And then we're going to go... Bloop, bloop, bloop. All right, so it's going to come out of here, out of here. So we're going to take this. No, it doesn't need to be insulated. High pressure gas vent. And then, no one then. Gas pump. That does not need to be steel, does it? No, I think we can get it with gold. And that's going to go in. Um, actually, if I'm recycling all this carbon dioxide, I don't even need to use airflow tiles. And that way I don't have to worry about the zombie spores floating through here. Feed me, Seymour! How are we looking? I think it's looking great. It's looking great. Furniture, flower thingy. No, we need prettier pots. Prettier pots. I wish I had like a black one. No, 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 not yet. <laughs> this is going to be so cool. I suppose... Now there's a door here. Otherwise, I was going to say we could just put a little small liquid lock there, but we're never going to need to get back in here. Now, how's Peggy going to get... I hope Peggy can climb the fire pole... I don't think you can move Peggy's. Where are my sporkids? I know we saved some sporkids. There's one.
To be fair, Kevin says, I played it with as minimal help possible without looking up answers how to play. So to do my due diligence in the adventure, I'm going to repeat all flight another 122 cycle colony, but do my homework and then I'll send the save to Echo and he will just be so proud. There were elements of it that I enjoyed. I enjoyed the canal. It was a very pretty canal. I guess we only have one sporkid seed. You were supposed to grab it. How do you like the floor spacing? No, what was better than the floor spacing was the, uh, was the piping. My name's Kevin. I need to get a pipe from here to here. So we could go something like this or hear me out. We could go something like this. There we go. <laughs> there are two so seeds in the bio room. Oh, that's right. Right in here, isn't there? So I can fit another one in there. I forgot about that. Yes. Don't worry, it's just zombie spores. Just like all the other diseases, they're not that big of a deal. <laughs> Breathe deep. Breathe deep. <laughs> Kevin says, why didn't I write Echo with pies? <sighs> didn't that feel good doing it the Kevin way? It is kind of freeing. But then your eyes can't ever unsee it. Hurry up! There we go. I should have made that a glass. It would have made it look a little prettier. All right, zombie, we've got a little bit of... I guess no. Watch this. Uh, where's my... Nothing. It's just fine. A little bit of zombie leakage, but it'll be fine. They're not growing. I wonder if it's counting the spores. Building disabled. Enable that building. So you actually want as many sporkids in there as possible. Yeah, most of this is slime. My goodness. I see like one. There it is. Incubating Sporb. Sporb? I guess this thing's called a Sporb. It's a related to the Morb. <laughs> You could also have a germ sensor to enable the pump as well. Yeah. Eventually there should it should just have a lot. So it doesn't really matter. I should have put some automation on there to be able to stop it though. Or is our plan just to create as many peggies as possible? I mean, I'm down with the peggies. Don't get, don't get me wrong. Oh, look at this. Look at all this water. I told you, chat. It's perfect. All right, let's get with this guy right here. We're going to go, what, three fuel tanks? Is it three fuel tanks and two? Uh, I don't remember. Let's just build them and see. Whoop. 
Oh, no, 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 no. You need first the living area. Still got a little bit of room. No third row of tanks for the water. I mean, it's not a bad idea, but um, the problem is I've already created this system that I do not feel like playing with again because it was a pain in the tuchus, um to have the overflow in. I mean, having a third row of tanks would be good because then I can do separate automation. And when this tank is empty, like it doesn't have any water, I could send a green signal which activates all of these and starts backfilling them. That'd be pretty cool. But I'm also broke on ores, so we will not. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see. Each one of these holds... 900, is it? Uh... Why won't you tell me? Nine hundred, there it is. I'm just blind. That other one had four fifty, so it only took two twenty-five of oxalite, so this is gonna take four fifty, four fifty, four fifty. So three four fifties. So we're probably gonna need three of these little small solid oxidizer tanks. Ugh. And then I need a battery. Woo! And I'm going to use one of these because we will be flying around. And a nose cone. Ha! <laughs> Look how glorious. And all of our obsidian is gone somewhere. Makes me wonder if I should have insulated these after all, because if it does boil the water... That's my concern. I need more obsidian. Where can we find some obsidian? I bet you find them used for some pipes. I know we use them for some pipes. Okay, it's dark. Obsidian gas pipes? Insulated obsidian gas pipes? No, no, no. That will not do. <laughs> Kutai said it first. Fair. Sardamalus, welcome back. Um, that'll give us enough subsidian that we can use to keep building ladders as well. Now let's check the ESS for the wallpaper. Only a thousand kilos, which means we only have enough for what? Two hundred and... 200 databanks? Ugh. Big ups. Big ups. Well, we have two untamed volcanoes sitting above your base. Dark Vorbug says those pipes are never getting hot because they're in the vacuum. But they're not in a vacuum when the rocket takes off. If you know what I mean. So when a rocket takes off, there's a bunch of exhaust, so it's sitting in an environment. <laughs> Kevin said at the end of the last stream, Kutai said, maybe you should stop here and play something else because my brain finally said, nope, you have to fix this. And as you saw, the fix was going to break me. <sighs> it was good. I'm looking forward to doing a video on it.
All right. Do we finally make some sleet wheat? Yes, we can. This petroleum is sitting at zero degrees. Now we have water. I love this little system. So the water just doesn't sit there. It continually, continuously flows. Highly recommended this. Highly recommend this for your own sleet wheat farms. But we're also gonna need some dirt. I wish I had rails, cause then I could throw um, a bunch of conveyor receptacles to load the dirt manually. Cause this is gonna take a lot of dupe labor. Weird Dream says, I am in pain, too, because food. <laughs> if y'all slept so long, you must be starving. What's on the foods menu? Am I going to mention Kevin's unique way of laying out pipes? Yes. Yes. Absolutely. Finally, after two streams, we have Sleet Wheat growing. Should I order pizza? It's going to be forever before the pizza gets there. Maybe we should put... Like one of these here. Ooh. Hold on. It would still take duplicate labor, but it'd take less. Because right now they pick up like one spot a piece. So that goes there. Oh, it does fit. And then I can use a couple of storage things right here. Put dirt in them and then they'll be able to pick it up. Yes. Why did we want sleet wheat? Because we're making bristle berry or um, berry sludge for space missions. We're going to be going on a lot of space missions in this series. Now I'm putting this on a four. Hopefully that doesn't bite us in the tuchus. Thank you for taking the time out of your life to come to my channel to fix my colony and allow me the opportunity to be a part of this. Kevin, of course. Of course. You gotta remember, Kevin, I'm a fan too, you know? Berry Sludge, the Ani equivalent of fruitcake. Absolutely. <laughs> So now that will be loaded up. 200 kilos, you're supposed to hold a thousand. Okay, it's, they're coming, it's coming. I wish there was a little bit more Rimworld than Ani. For instance, I don't want to trigger this when it gets down to 9995. I'd rather trigger it like it says, when less than 500 or less than 50% full, trigger the errand. Some of that sort of quality of life stuff would be nice. And why is there phosphorite everywhere here? Look at our sleet wheat growing so well! Isn't there like a fruit like cake in the gas range you can make? Actually, let's put down the gas range. I don't. Um... Copy settings. Oh, yes, you do. So I'm moving the farm. Whether you like it or not. Oh, where does this one go? Hold on. Light, 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 light. Oh, yeah. We'll just take that whole one right there. 
No, 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 cancel. Let me replace these. Nincompoops. Right there. Right there. Whoop. Has anybody noticed the defaults on the batteries and tanks? The defaults? What do you mean the defaults? I'm... We did well on them. Yeah, it's 9060. It's not that I need a gas range. I just want to take a look at it. A little, a little looky-loo. Pop, 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 pop. What's funny is you can take this tile and overwrite that one, but you can't take this tile and overwrite this one. It's obnoxious. There are no chickens. You're lying. There are chickens, none. You missed... You missed Echo having fun with your colony this morning, says Lucky Wolf. Gas range entry in the database shows all recipes. I'm 75% sure. I think you're right, Colonel Sanders. Don't! But you know we have to put it down there. Look how pretty it looks. Boop. Morgar in with the follow. Welcome. Just a just a smidge of chaos. Season season seven episodes of Suits. Oh, I gotta find this conversation. Somebody fill me in. What were what were they watching that had them staying up so late? Morgra says, Hi, Echo. I've been following along on your VODs of this series and super stoked to finally catch you live. Welcome, Morgra. So glad you made a trip. I was watching a lot of suits and I sort of fell off because I got really tired of the... Oh, look. He doesn't have a law degree. He's practicing law. And... That seemed like this whole storyline every single season. And I was like, no, stop it. Do something else. Just let him be a good guy and win. Dark Vorbug with a gifted sub. This one went to Morger. Thank you, Dark. Uh, what is this? Oh, here's a... Our first fully assembled Peggy. There seems to be no limit to the number of biobots that we could produce. Now I'm worried that they're stuck though. They see they won't. Will you jump? No. What if I give you a ladder right here? There we go. Ha <laughs> ha. Go to work, Peggy. No, no, no. Go go do stuff. No, no, no. You're on the wrong side, Peggy. Peggy. Go. Now run. Why aren't you doing things? Oh, it's because they can't get over. I need to get them in the base. Now go and do things. There you go. No, Peggy! Oh, Peggy, you're getting lost, aren't you? There goes Peggy to drop off the polluted oxygen. You can make a pipe pass through this so Peggy can jump past the pole like a star dancer. <laughs> 
Can it not get past the suit check? No, I don't think the suit checkpoint is it. I think it's just uh, Peggy being Peggy. Where did Peggy go? Peggy! Oh, Peggy, what are you doing up here? Okay, what if I give you some sweep commands? You don't sweep, huh? Oh, where are we going? Where are we going, Peggy? They're going to grab more polluted oxygen. What does a Peggy do? There they go! Peggy's in! Now do this. Actually, I'll... I need to save it for the next Peggy. Nothing so far. <laughs> Peggy just wants to see the stars. How far along are we till the next Peggy? Oh, is it eating some carbon dioxide? No. There's very little carbon dioxide. It might consume some. <laughs> Pyroy said, I'm Peggy. I'm too good for your sweep BS. No, I thought we had a lot of carbon uh, carbon dioxide in here. All right, what if I do this? Just for a minute. Why are you pumping the CO2 in? I'm pumping the CO2 in so it can pick up more zombie spores and then out so it can make more peggies. I guess they could get over there that way, too. Oh. Wasn't I collecting? I was collecting carbon dioxide. That might be a better way to do this. Just load it up like this. This seems much smarter. There we go. We got it open it anyways. The wallpaper, the room black. Redonkulous. I should have remembered the wallpaper. That's on me. Uh, do you want to do the final prediction? Actually, I'm going to do it so the queen can get in on the business. Where's my prediction button? Prediction, prediction, prediction. Start prediction. What's in the blueprint? You got five minutes. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Still holding up on research. Why won't they build this? I have 40 duplicates on this colony! 40! How are we doing with suits? Look at, I mean, this is great suit pressure. Peggy, how did you get out? Uh, Peggy's gonna be able to get out, but not in. Because the Pegmaster <laughs> um, can jump from me. Oh, okay. No, I left it open. Okay, that's how they got out. <laughs> Colonel Sanders said it too. <laughs> oh, Colonel Sanders. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Now we're going to get it loaded up with some CO2. Oh, look at the zombie spores. Now they're climbing. There just wasn't a lot of 
Carbon dioxide? I thought there was more carbon dioxide in there, to be honest. Oh, this is gorgeous. What a fun little system. And we got our nice little toy bot. Doesn't somebody have a nightstand we can put the toy bot on? Oh, there's been water in the apartments. Water in the apartments. We'll just start with the first one. Toy bot. You should invert the ladder and the pole for Peggy's. Uh, you know how what a pain in the butt that'll be? What is that one bedroom filled with, said Lucky Wolf? Shovels! <laughs> Ooh, Greek bowl with a pandiculate! Oh! Oh! Oh, thank you. If only I had chain deconstruct mod, I know. I've been thinking about that one too. What's going on in here? And a drink. Cheers to you. Oh, wow. I think this is, we have two minutes left in this blueprint. And I think there are more echoes in this one than the last one. But why? They're a little... We needed a secure storage area. And the shovel's ribbed around here. And this is Dumpkin Pie's house. And we like to mess with Dumpkin a little bit. So... There's also Sporkids. That's where our Sporkids went. Just take a look at this. Pumps take a percentage of the germs based on mass, so having a lot of CO2 will make the pump carry very few germs per package. What do you mean, Kutai? A percent of the germs based on mass. Yeah, but the pump can only take 500 kilos regardless. Oh, Mrs. Music Lady's all in. I love my house. <laughs> I forgot to check the fruitcake like in the gas range. Thank you, Slicky Jeb. I don't know. Like, that doesn't make sense to me. Lucky Wolf's all in. Let's go check it out. 20 kilos? Oh, no! They can't be above 10. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger! Oops. Oops. I didn't think we'd been gone that long. All right, this is okay. This is fine. No, we're only in times three speed right now. A buffer tank? Ugh. Nah, I'm not even gonna bother with it. It's got to I'm just gonna wait till it gets down to 10k. Cause that that amount of carbon dioxide stays in there. Oh, but to Kutai's point, is it gonna say? No, it's not gonna say how much is in it. Oh, here it, it's right here. Twelve thousand germs. Oh no, that's in each tile. If there is one kilo and you take 500 grams, you take 50% germs. If you have 10 kilos, you take 5%. Okay, yes, but that 5% when you have 10 kilos is probably higher than the percentage of germs that would be in it if there was only one kilo worth of pressure. You know what I mean? Because there's so many, so many more carbon dioxide, the zombie spores are in there a lot more. Doff says that's not how the percentage works. It's a set amount. 
I don't know, to be honest. I don't, I'm only saying conjecture because remember when we only had like 500 grams in the room? There were dozens of germs. Now there's thousands. Can we get a germ map? Boop. Remember, um, there are no germs in this line right here. That's why I didn't do it down here. I am not dumping um, zombie spores. Remember, this machine takes all the zombie spores. So this is actually clean carbon dioxide. Oh, kind of new it must have been updated because it used to. Yeah, not anymore. Whoop. All right, what are we down to? 16 kilos? We'll wait until they come back alive. Twenty six percent for more Peggy's. How long does Peggy live for? And how why can't I find Peggy? There's Peggy. Biofuel 118 kilojoules. Oh, this is so not worth it. This is so not worth it. Peggy's almost halfway. You get the steel back. Okay, that makes it a little bit better. That was a long way to carry table salt, Peggy. Nuki Nuclear in with the six months. Thank you, thank you, Nuki. Can you find shallow pie? <laughs> nice try, Dark Wizard. Speaking of which, how are we doing on food? Oh, we're fine. Even though we're gonna run out of plastic. Gas range, thank you. Slicky. Gas range. Pepper bread. No, we don't have a renewable source of pitcher pepper nuts yet. You're talking about mixed berry pie? It would take grub fruit. Stuffed berry. Pinch of pepper nuts. Ideally, nobody on the planetoid would eat, be eating the bristle, uh, the bristle stuff. The berry sludge. Kutai, I see that math, and I understand it, um, but what I'm saying is I think there might be more germs in the 10 kilos. 5% of the amount of germs in the 10 kilos could be more than the amount of germs in 50% of 500. Okay, we're down to 8. Let me cancel that. There we go. That's my theory, though. I have no way to prove that because we don't really see. I could have put a germ meter on this. Where is it? It's a germ sensor somewhere. Maybe under medicine? No. Maybe I don't have it yet. Germ sensor. I could have put a germ sensor and we could have tracked it. Boop. All right. But it works well. But this Peggy is still... I'm wondering... It specifically says there is no limit to how many Peggies you can have. But it seems to me this is going to take almost as long as the one life cycle of Peggy. I'm going to keep it going forever. 
But I'm not 100% sure that, like, by the time this Peggy comes out, I think the other Peggy's going away. All right, where else are we? Uh, oh, I don't have the blueprint mod. Remind me next stream, I need the blueprint mod. So I don't have to rebuild that interior again and again and again and again. <laughs> what do Peggy's do? What do zombie spores do to dupes? Um, it's bad, but it's not so bad. It's like a minus five to like seven different stats. I don't know if it shows in here. Yeah, because zombie spore is not the infection uh, disease, maybe. Yeah, it doesn't show it. It'd be in the Ani Wiki, though. What do Peggy's do? You didn't answer, because I don't know what you want me to say. Do they peg? <laughs> Is that what you're trying to get me to say, Head? Do they sweep? No. Peggy's do not sweep. They, they can move things, but apparently they don't sweep. I mean, they did grab some table salt. Do they dig? Yes, I do believe they can dig. We'll have to do some Peggy experiments. Enough of that mess there. Um, have we left any fires burning today? Is this enough? No, I'm gonna need more in here. Look at this water. And everybody, remember all the naysayers about the water? <laughs> so Peggy's a glorified dog. Peggy's don't sound much different from rovers, but rovers will sweep. But for some reason, this Peggy, oh wait, let's see what Peggy does. Peggy does sweep, 10 kilos at a time. So yeah, it just sounds like a rover then to me. <laughs> Yo, Peggy. How you doing, Peggy? Up. Uh, check this out. They are, where's the age? Oh, they didn't put the age on here. That's obnoxious. Everything's got an age. Like this steam turbine is 700 cycles old. Why didn't we put an age on Peggy? But they're 50% done. Snipe says I'll be the guinea pig in the zombie spores. Yep. I can tell you right now. I know it's in the Ani Wiki. Ani Wiki zombie spores. It really isn't bad. Do, do, do. It causes minus 10 to all attributes for 18 cycles. So minus 10 to attributes. So basically the only risk is the fact that they will get slow and then they may not make it back in time. Blueprint! 112 plus 89. Oh my goodness, that's 190, that's 201, 234, 235,000 echoes up for grab. Chat, you ready? Everybody close your eyes. I'm going to listen for the pretty sound. Pretty sound. Sound? Sound. Oh... Uh, I know. I know. Of course. Of course. 
The pink booties. Of course they're the pink booties. Recycle. Whoop. Duplicants. This is what we need to do. But do they come out? Like, I'm going to do this pay, right? Let's do the pay. Restyle outfit. So next time we see a pay, we'll see if they're wearing those clones out of the pod. Pay should have all the pinks. Basic bubble. <laughs> this is so funny. Footwear. Yes. Gloves. Boom. All right, now save template. And that's it, right? We have to do an entire wardrobe's thing. We have to do an entire wardrobe, like, episode. Boop, 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 boop. Where is Duncan? <laughs> oh, it still makes me chuckle. Yeah. Why can't you do it here? What am I forgetting? Oh, it's down in Blueprint now. Oh, look at some of the natural outfits. That's kind of cool. Where well, there they are. Restyle outfit. I know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh, wonderful. Wonderful. We've done a lot. We've gotten Peggy's going, even though Peggy, I don't think you can get more than one. You might be able to overlap Peggy's by just a smidge, but this Peggy is only 40% done, and that other Peggy is 50% dead. So, you know how that's going to go. Can anybody resolve the prediction? I can. Thank you. It was closed again. Complete prediction. Boom. You might be able to get more Peggy's if you had more zombie spores. How do you get more zombie spores? You're not gonna be able to get more. Like, look at this. 10,000 germs. This could be Kutai's theory, though, that the percentage of zombie spores in here I don't know. Can you set priorities for Peggy's? No. I do not think Peggy's in here. Peggy does what Peggy wants. Where's the picture today? Is it Peggy? No, it's not Peggy. I don't know where to take the picture. I feel like we didn't do a lot. We are out of plastic. Because you're a hero, Echo. We're at 4,990. Oh, what is going on here? Scalding? Oh, Shallow, you didn't put your thing back on. Fixed, we fixed Kevin's colony. Did we though? Did we? No, don't fill it up. I guess we'll just have to remember it. We'll remember it. Um, I guess it's gonna have to be Peggy's. What a boring thumbnail. Of course, it's a VOD. 
Love you, Vodlanders. Much love to the wonderful Vodlanders, but there's just not a lot of them. Kutai Ed said, somebody said in chat they're keeping five bots with five to six sporkids. Wow. More sporkids per CO2? Are we freezing water in the planters? Probably Dex. Probably. We'll have to thing to fiddle with the uh with the temps on that temperature sensor. Why not Kevin's fixed colony for thumbnail? Because I'm making a regular video on it. This'll do. Everybody get ready to say cheese. Three, two, one. Cheddar. I'll take a nice sharp cheddar too, by the way. Don't be giving me any of that medium, that medium cheddar. Cheeseburger cheese again. Geeky Gamer. That's not a type of cheese. Cheesecake. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. Today is Sunday. I hope everybody gets their sleep schedule fixed for those of us who are still forced to lie to ourselves about what time it actually is outside. Boop, boop, boop. What is sleep? No kidding. The more things change, the more they stay the same. That's a quote, isn't it? It's like a famous quote. Baby Bell? Oh, I do know Baby Bell cheese. What is that? A Baby Bell, is that mozzarella? Or is that cheddar? Or can you buy different types of Baby Bell cheese? Any kind, says Tebow. It's like high quality Baby Bell cheese. And they come in those little packages. I have to buy something. We normally get the, like the long sleeves of cheddar slices. But once you open that package, you're supposed to throw it away after five days. And I can't eat that much cheese in a week. The original you see in Red Wax is eat them, says call, call me Ishmael. First time chatter, by the way. Welcome, Ishmael. The, eat them. Whatever it is, it's good. Just inhale the cheese. Grant Theorem says some people live in a fantasy world others can only dream of. Oh my goodness. You are correct. Bloop, bloop. This new raid screen. Really? I don't know. Why would I want to raid somebody? I have no idea who they are. It's like they just randomly throw people up there. I can't, I can't look at it that way. I have to go to this screen here. Who knows? Joe says, I love my fantasy world. It's pretty and warm here. <laughs> oh. That's how you make new friends. Yeah. Yeah. No one's online. No wonder Sundays are such a big day. No one's streaming. Pop, pop, pop.
Have we ever raided Eraja? I can't remember. I don't think we have, so we're gonna do that. And it's still Ani, so that'll be that'll work well. I hope they are comfortable with being raided by a bunch of chaotic chaotic neutral people. We're going to find out though. The raid is up. I'm going to run these credits. I will see you on Wednesday. Uh, exclamation raid one and raid two. If you are a sub, if you're not a sub exclamation raid three, please consider hitting that follow button. We only need like 10 more before we do our 12 hour 5,000 follower stream. I appreciate all very, very much. The credits are about a week old, but they will be updated tomorrow or Tuesday. So until next time, much love, happy gaming, and I'll talk to you soon. Mm -hmm.